Hey guys, we just wanted to tell you about our new merch. What? We have new merch? Are you serious? Yeah, and it's so cuddly and adorable. Wait a minute. Do we have unicorns? <laughs> Daisy, of course we don't have unicorns. But we do have snugglers. What? They're adorable. Snugglers are your adorable, squeezy, cuddly friend. I want them, Molly. They're so cute. We also have backpacks and t-shirts. You guys can check it out by going to starsquad.shop. Now it's time to get to the video. O-M-G. Like, what are you wearing? What, me? Are you talking to me? Uh, yeah, duh. Do you see anyone else sitting next to me? By the way, why are you sitting next to me? You're so uncool. Um, because I needed to ha take a seat so I wasn't late and got detention. <laughs> I actually did my homework today, surprisingly. Wow, Molly, I'm so proud of you. Thanks, Daisy. What are you wearing, by the way? You look ridiculous. Oh, this wizard hat? That's because my family um, went and visited Harry Potter World. It was amazing. Oh, that is so lame. Harry Potter is for babies. No, it's not, Silva. Harry Potter is in basic. I know plenty of adults that love Harry Potter. Actually, they're obsessed with it. Yeah, because they're lame and they don't want to grow up. Who would want to grow up? Growing up's boring. Why are you wearing that alien outfit? Oh, I got that when we were at Disney. I think it's adorable, right? No, you look like a weirdo. Ugh, oh, whatever. I'm just going to ignore you, Sarah, because you're being rude. And I'm going to dream about cupcakes. Ah, cupcakes. And lunch! Ooh, I can't wait till lunch today. We're having pizza! No, you you don't want to eat lunch. Look, you're annoying, and I don't really like you that much, and you're a total loser, but I'm not going to let you, well, fall to the hands of the evil lunch lady. What? What are you talking about, Sarah? <laughs> evil lunch lady? Is she for real right now, Molly? Yeah, are you for real? Well, lunch lady on um, Marge makes the best pizzas in the world. I love Lodge Mudge. She's so nice. Uh, yeah. Well, last night she proved that she was totally evil. Wait, what? Yeah, I was here late for cheerleading practice and I went up to the cafeteria to like grab a soda and guess what I saw. <sighs> I can't believe I gotta work late again. Can't they find me any help around here? I mean, seriously, Large Marge has very large feet. She needs to sit down every once in a while. Ugh. And these kids, I tell you what, I try to take such good care of them, and all they want to eat is sugar. Well, <laughs> I'll show them. <laughs> Large Marge stayed late and worked. Did you not hear what she said? She said, I'll show them. Well, maybe she was going to show us even more pizza. You know, that's better than eating candy. Ooh, pizza and candy. Sounds like the perfect Friday lunch for me. Molly, it's that Friday. Oh, uh, sounds like the perfect whatever day it is uh, for me. Ugh, you're not listening. I'll tell you what happened next so you finally believe me. <laughs> now, I'll show them all. These kids can't be a brat on my watch. And all that sugar definitely makes them brats. Oh my god. Large Marge has gone completely out of her mind. Lost all of her marbles and she wasn't even playing the squid game. Ugh, oh, this cannot be good. I'm not eating that pizza. She's definitely put some toxic waste on it. Gross. Holy guacamole! Large Marge is evil! I don't know if I would be so um, quick to judge Large Marge. She's made our lunches since the dawn of time. I mean, I'm pretty sure she made the dinosaurs' lunches. <laughs> what do you want for lunch today? We've got pizza, we got bananas. Okay, okay. Seriously, T-Rex, don't bite me. I'm trying to, you know, give you the best lunch possible. 
Well, whatever. You can believe whatever you want, but I'm not eating that toxic pizza she made. She may have been around since the dinosaurs, but she's lost all her marbles. I'm going to Starbucks for um, my lunch. I already ordered it. It's going to be delicious. But Daisy, Mom didn't give us enough money to buy Starbucks, and then I'm going to be hungry. Well, Molly, I, 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 I don't know if I should believe Sarah. Her story seems pretty realistic. Maybe we should go up and check on the lunch lady and see if she's as evil as she thinks, as, she, as Sarah thinks. Large Marge wouldn't do that, Molly. She's so nice. Um, well, there's no hurt in trying. I mean, we don't want to eat poison pizza, do we? I guess not, Molly. You're probably right. Okay, I'm going to go incognito. How are you going to do that? I'm going to use my um, wizard hat to do it. Duh. Molly, is that you? Oh, uh, yeah, it is. Molly, your voice sounds hilarious. What happened? I told you already, Daisy. I used my Harry Potter magic hat to turn me into a policeman. <laughs> Who better to than to interrogate the lunch lady and find out if she's evil? Um, yeah, okay, well, if you say so. Come on, let's go. Call me Sergeant, uh, McDonald's. Sergeant McDonald's? Are you kidding? Sorry, I'm hungry, so all I can think about is, mm, cheeseburgers and chicken nuggets and, 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 and delicious ice cream for McDonald's. Oh, boy, my sister's crazy. Okay, Sergeant McDonald's, let's go. Who could that be? What, a police officer? Oh, uh, uh, uh. Oh, I see that you have a box marked toxic waste. What's that about, huh? What are you talking about? Oh, this, this is nothing. <laughs> Don't pay any attention to that. Actually, I think you've been, well, putting toxic waste on these pizzas. Dun, dun, dun! I just made that noise for a dramatic effect. What, me? I wouldn't do that to these children. I've been feeding them lunches since we were all dinosaurs. Uh, did you actually go to school yourself? We, we, we didn't come from dinosaurs. Well, I think we did. <laughs> I'm pretty sure we did. I was here when the dinosaurs were eating. Uh, okay. I think you may have lost your marbles. Daisy, uh, do you want to come bear witness to this? Um, yeah, okay if I have to. <laughs> Wait a minute. You look kind of familiar to me. What's your name? Uh, my name's Sergeant McDonald's. What? Sergeant McDonald's like the restaurant? Yeah, my brother. He started McDonald's restaurants. You may have heard of him. Wow, he was a lot more successful than you, huh? What? No, I wanted to be a police officer. That's so much better than owning a million restaurants. Yeah, I'm, I'm not rich or anything, but my job's important. Sheep was Molly. Try to stick to the subject. Yeah, so anyway... Where's that box of toxic waste? You don't want that. It's full of terrible things for you. Then why are you putting it on the pizza? All right, that's it. You're under arrest. What? No, I have to feed the children. No, you've lost your marbles. Now hands behind your back. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you, Large Marge. I don't understand. Could that be used against me? Yeah, I already said that. If you say anything, it could be used against you. Ugh, Large Marge, she's something else. Hello? Uh, Large Marge? What, what's going on here? And and wait, did, did you did you store that box of toxic waste or did you throw it out? Because I just realized I may have put my, some of my chemistry stats for the students in there. Oopsie. Uh, I was I was trying to get rid of it for you like you asked. Uh, and I, 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 I think there's been a large misunderstanding here. Wait, what? The chemistry teacher gave you the toxic waste, so you're both in on it? What? No! Oh my gosh, this is so confusing! Alright, alright. Sergeant McDonald's will solve this. I think, if I can figure out what's going on here. Maddie! Maddie, you're my, I mean, Sergeant McDonald's! What? What, what is it? Uh-oh. Hey, wait a minute. You're not a sergeant. You... you you're not a police officer. You, you, you're a student? What's going on here? Um, I'm not really sure myself, but um, Sarah told me that she overheard you saying you were putting something on the pizza last night when she was here after school for cheerleading practice and told us not to eat the pizza. 
What? <laughs> Mr. Adams, can you please let me out of these handcuffs? Sure, and you students seem like you're going to end up with a lot of detention. <laughs> Don't no, 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 no. I've never had detention. This isn't my fun. It's all Molly. What? Daisy! Way to throw me under the bus. Bye! Okay, Molly, would you like to explain? Yeah, uh, Sarah said that you put toxic waste on the pizza, and I came up here to find out, and, um, yeah, you were holding a box that said toxic waste. And I turned into a police officer because I have this magic hat from Harry Potter World. Well, that kind of sums it up, and it is kind of funny because what I was putting on the pizza was onions and peppers and some other vegetables because you kids eat way too much sugar. And the toxic waste was mine. It's a byproduct <laughs> when you're a chemistry teacher. Sometimes toxic waste happens. Yeah, I get that. <laughs> Oops, I just made some toxic waste of my own. <laughs> Molly, uh, you're still going to have detention. Wait, what? Why? No fair! Well, you can still take a slice of pizza with you. You know, if you don't think I poisoned it. Large Marge. <laughs> this was all just a big misunderstanding. You're the best lunch lady ever. You should get an award. But I don't ever get an award. If I give you one, can I get out of detention? No. No, Molly. Take your slice of pizza and head to detention. Oh, man. Okay, Luke, are you ready for this? I don't know. I'm feeling kind of nervous, Daisy. I've never asked anyone to a dance before. Luke, I've coached you a million times. You gotta just say, okay, you need to practice again. I don't want to just tell you what to say. I want it to be heartfelt. Yeah, okay, I'll practice on you, Daisy. Okay, go ahead, Luke. Um, I was wondering... Take your time, Luke. Really, remember, it's supposed to be heartfelt. Okay, we, we've been friends for a really long time, and I think you're really pretty, and you're really funny, and... I really would like you to go to the dance with me. Here's some flowers. How's that? That was great! Good job, Luke! She's totally gonna say yes. Are you sure? I mean, I don't know. Absolutely positive. Now I'll meet you in the house in five minutes. Don't chicken out. Okay, I'll try not to. La 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 la. <laughs> Ew, what's a horrible smell? Molly, did you fart? Yep, and there's more where that came from. <laughs> Molly, you made the whole house smell like bad guacamole. But but you can't have a house that smells bad. Okay, I better go get a nail flesh nail. What am I going to do? Why is she freaking out? It's not like we're expecting anybody over here. <laughs> oh, man, I shouldn't have eaten so much guacamole for lunch. Oh, we got to get this smell out of here. Dizzy, what are you doing with the fire extinguisher? I'm trying to make it smell better. I filled it with air freshener. Oh my god, it smells so bad in here. There, I sprayed it right at you. Hey! Ow, that hurts! Ah, you're burning my eyes with that! You're burning my eyes with your stinky farts! Oh, look, Molly, someone's here to see you. See me? I didn't invite anybody over. Oh, it's Luke! Hey, Luke, come on in! I'm just hanging out. Oh, something smells like flowers and bad guacamole oh uh, yeah never mind okay i'm gonna give you guys some alone time alone time <laughs> why hey look come over here and sit down oh uh, molly uh, why don't you come over here i i have something i want to talk to you about oh uh, okay what happened to your arm is it missing did you cut it off uh no it's just behind my back oh <laughs> that was kind of funny wasn't it oh <laughs> uh, yeah you're super funny, Molly. Your jokes are like the best. Uh, so what is it you wanted to say? <laughs> What's wrong with your tongue? Did it get tied up or something? Yeah. <laughs> uh, Molly, uh, we've been friends for like ever since kindergarten. I know, right? Um, so I was wondering, um, yeah, I think you're really cool and you're funny and pretty. Wait, what? What'd you say? Pretty. You, th you think I'm pretty? S seriously? Yeah, and I was wondering, um, will you go to the school dance with me? What What are these? They're for you. They're roses, because I'm asking you to the school dance. Wow, they smell awesome. Wow, Luke, I 
I didn't know you'd ever ask me to the school dance. Uh, uh, uh. What does that mean? Uh, 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 you're so nervous to say yes, huh? <laughs> I can't go with you, Luke. I can't go with you, Luke. Wait, what? What? But I brought you flowers, and Daisy said if I asked, heartfelt like and all, that you'd say yes. Um, well, uh, I'm sorry, Luke, but I'm gonna go to the dance with Dylan. What? That bad boy? He's always got detention. Uh, how do you think Dylan and I met? <laughs> we have detention together a lot. Okay. Um, all right, that's fine. I'll just paste this smile on my face and pretend everything is okay. <laughs> Luke? Oh, well, that was weird. <laughs> oh, man. I really shouldn't have eaten that bad guacamole. Daisy! Molly, seriously, you just ruined everything. I heard the whole thing. Also, I ate your Reese cup. What? You deserve it, Molly. You broke Luke's heart. What? No, I didn't. Luke will be just fine. Uh, no. Newsflash, he's been in love with you since kindergarten. Wait, what? Yeah, and you're going to the dance with that dummy Dylan? Don't call him a dummy. He's not dumb. He just gets attention because, like me, he doesn't ever do his homework. But he's actually really smart. Uh-huh, sure he is, Molly. Do you know what your life will be like if you go to the dance with Dylan? Um, wonderful? Let me paint a picture for you, Molly. Mommy, mommy, mommy. TV. Sorry, Savannah, we can't. Our cable got turned off. Hey, mommy, mommy. What is it, Hannah? What's wrong? I'm hungry. I want cheese. I'm sorry. We don't have any groceries right now. We don't have any cheese. Um, uh, maybe I could get some on Friday. I do have some plain bread, though. No, you bread for breakfast. I want it. Oh, I have two kids, and I can't give them anything. We're so poor. Hey, honey, I'm home. It's me, Dylan. <laughs> oh, great. Your dad's home. Maybe he got a job today. Hey, what's up, honey? Hey, kids. Uh, how'd the job hunt go? Oh, <laughs> not so good, but come look at this. Uh, okay. Is that a new motorcycle? Oh, my gosh, Dylan, what are you doing? Ooh, that guy, new motorcycle. Well, I just needed a new ride to get to my new job. But you don't have a new job, Dylan! Uh, yeah, duh, but when I do, I'm gonna have a sweet ride to get there! How are we gonna take the girls anywhere on that thing? Uh, uh, they could walk behind? No, Dylan! Oh, we don't have any cheese, we don't have any TV for the girls, we're poor! And it's all your fault! Oh my gosh, I can't believe my retirement includes living next to a dumpster in a tent. And it's starting to get cold out because it's almost fall. <sighs> hey, honey, I'm home. Oh, hey, Dylan. Uh, what's up? Um, <laughs> I'm just living the life, you know. I fixed up my Harley today. You still have that bike? You could sell it and maybe, I don't know, get us an apartment or something. Give up my bike? Listen, babe, that's never gonna happen. Like, I love that bike more than I love you and my guitar. I could sing you a song, though. Isn't it great to be married to me? I'm so awesome, can't you see? No, it's terrible to be married to you! Why did I ever go to the school dance with you and fall in love with you? Oh, because I'm gorgeous and I'm the bad boy of the school. Guacamole! I know, right, Molly? This is why you don't want to go to the school dance with the bad boy. Oh my gosh, but I've already said I would go with Dylan. Well, tell him you made a mistake and you meant to say yes to Luke. How's that gonna work? Well, how did you say yes exactly? Uh, he sent me a text message? Perfect! Just say you got their phone numbers mixed up and you can't go to the dance with him. Hello? Is, like, anybody home? Oh, my gosh. It's Dylan! Well, Molly, go tell him. Oopsie. Ah, this is going to be fun to watch. Oh, <laughs> Dylan. Yeah, come on in. Hey, what's up, Molly? Uh, so I was wondering, what should I wear to this dance? Um, that's the thing about the dance. Um, I accidentally said yes, but what I meant was, 
Wait a minute, you're actually not gonna go to the dance with me? Um, well, <laughs> uh, you see, I have this problem where <laughs> I fart a lot. Wait, what? S seriously, that's disgusting. Oh, that smells horrible! <coughs> I don't want to go to the dance with you if you're going to be like that. Well, I fart all day. Bye! Well, that was easier than I thought. Time to call up Luke and tell him I made a mistake. Hello? <laughs> Who is this? Uh, Luke, can you not see my phone number? I'm sorry, Molly. I couldn't see it through all the tears. I mean, I mean, I was cutting an onion, so that's why I was crying. Oh my gosh, are you crying because I didn't go to the dance with you? No! I was cutting an onion, for real! Uh, okay, well, Luke, I just wanted to say I'm sorry. It was a horrible prank, and I like you, too, and we can go to the dance. Seriously? Really? <laughs> okay, let me let me just put down this onion. Okay, okay. No, I'm still crying. I'm so glad we're going to the dance together. Me, too, Luke. Me, too. So, um, want to come over and hang out? Um, does it still smell like rotten guacamole over there? Um, the uh, no. <laughs> okay, I'll be right over. <laughs> Luke's coming over and I'm going to the dance with him. Oh, man. Should never eat guacamole ever again. Hey, Molly. Oh, man. Seriously? <laughs> oh, Molly. Seriously, don't eat guacamole ever again. And definitely not before the dance. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Mmm, this donut is delicious! Molly, is that all you do is just sit on the couch and eat at donuts all day long? I mean, it's Saturday, don't you want to do something? Yeah, like you, homework! Actually, I'm not, I'm doing homework right now. I'm watching these adorable panda videos. Yeah, well, I'm watching Brooke High, and I have to see what happens to Megan in this episode. Mmm, I also have to eat more of this blueberry donut. Girls, girls, <laughs> hi girls, um, I've got to do some work today. What? It's Saturday, Mom. Don't be ridiculous. No, I have to go to the office. It's called adulting. Whoa, adulting stinks. I hope I never turn into an adult. Trust me, Molly, <laughs> being a kid is way more fun. <laughs> but I really do need to go to the office. Okay, well, see you later. I'm just going to keep eating donuts. Mmm, mmm, delicious. You know, Molly, eating an apple once in a while wouldn't hurt you. Actually, it'd be really good for you. Yeah, Molly. You just eat a donut diet all the time. I don't just eat donuts. Sometimes I eat cupcakes, and sometimes I eat Reese cups. Oh, Molly. <sighs> Your diet is terrible. We're going to have to work on that. Okay, Mom, sure, but not on a Saturday. Okay, well, we'll see you later, Mom. Oh, no, 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 no. You girls aren't staying home alone. Well, we can't go to the office with you. No, you're going to have a babysitter. Ah, oh, babysitter, Mom, come on. No one wants a babysitter at our age. I know, Molly, but just for now, I think maybe another year with a babysitter. Another year? Oh, we're almost practically grown up. Didn't you just say that you're not an adult yet? Okay, yeah, but I'm old enough to not have a babysitter. I think a babysitter would be fun. Of course you would, Daisy. Such a goody two-shoes. Well, I don't think having a babysitter will be bad. When you find out who it is, you'll be super excited. It's Grandma. Oh, Grandma. You mean your mom, right? No, I mean Dad's mom. Oh, no. What? Your Dad's mom is really nice. I know she's nice, but she's so old. She's like the Crypt Keeper. Molly, don't be rude. I think I hear her now. Hello, is anybody home? Oh, these hips don't work like they used to. Why you gotta have so many stairs out front? She complains a lot, Mom. Oh, there you all are. Oh, Grandma, I, I didn't know your hips were so bad you're in a wheelchair now. Oh, yes. <laughs> it's a slow wearing out process to be old. Hi, Grandma. It's nice to see you. Good job, Molly. I'm so glad you're being polite. Grandma, I love your hair. You look like a glamour to me. Get it? Glamour? Oh, Daisy, you're so kind. Okay, well, I'll see you guys later. Grandma, call me if you have any problems, okay? 
Oh, we won't have any problems, will we, girls? No, because we'll probably be so bored. Oh, nonsense. We could play a nice game of, well, Parcheesi or something. Parcheesi? What's that? Ooh, I love Parcheesi. That's when they put Parmesan and regular cheese on the top of your, your pizza. It's so good. I don't think that's what she meant, Molly. Oh, <laughs> no, Molly. Parcheesi is a game. Oh, I thought you were talking about delicious pizza. No, no, no. I can't eat pizza anymore. I'm allergic to dairy. Oh, wow, that's horrible. Getting gold is terrible. Tell me about it. Now, how about we watch one of my shows on TV? Um, ow, Grandma, you ran over my foot with your wheelchair. What's this garbage? Brooke, hi, turn this right away. Oh, breaking news. Oh, the news. Grandma, that's all you ever want to watch. The news is very informative. Oh, Daisy, can I see you in the kitchen for a minute? Molly, what is it? Uh, Daisy, I have an idea. Is it to eat all the Reese Cups again? Because, Molly, oh, you already did that. <laughs> no. Looking up a spell. A spell? What are you talking about? Girls, are you staying out of trouble in there? Of course we are, Grandma. <laughs> we wouldn't be getting into trouble, would we, Daisy? Uh, but no. Okay, well, could one of you bring me... <coughs> <coughs> a glass of water. <coughs> I choked on my dentures. Ew, gross, Grandma. I'm not taking a glass of water. That's gross. Well, one of us needs to. She choked on her dentures. Ew, Grandma has fake teeth. Gross. Here you go, Grandma. Try not to swallow your teeth again. Oh, <laughs> I don't know why they made these teeth so small. I can swallow them just so easily. Oh, my gosh. Oh, finally, I found a spell. Molly, what's this spell for? Just need a couple of household ingredients, and everything will be great. Molly, what exactly are you making? Milk, okay. Okay, I should better not drink too much of it. I actually have to make something with this. Molly, what are you making? Tell me right now. Okay, fine, Miss Pushy, Miss Bossy, Miss Grumpy. Molly, quit calling me names. I'm your sister. You have to like me. Correction. I have to love you because you're my sister. I don't really have to like you. Yes, you do, Molly. Okay, shh. Grandma's going to hear you. Oh, wait. Never mind. <laughs> Grandma can't hear anything. I am making a spell. Well, actually, a potion to make us adults so we don't have to have a babysitter. Uh, Molly, are you sure that's a good idea? It's a great idea. Quit trying to talk me out of it because I'm doing this. Well, if it works, I guess we don't have to be with boy and grandma all day. Exactly. We can go to the water park or camping or, or to the arcade or the ice cream place or anywhere we want. Exactly, Molly. Let's do this. Is that it, Molly? Ew, it smells horrible. Well, if um we drink it, maybe we'll be grown-ups. Yeah, if we can stomach it. It smells awful. Well, we have to try, Molly. We're going to be stuck with booing Grandma. Hi, guys. Are you home? Hello? Are you there? Brookie! Oh, my gosh. It's so good to see you. Hey, I was wondering if you guys wanted to come out and see my new scooter. It's amazing. OMG. Yeah, you got a new scooter? That sounds awesome. But, Molly, what about the potion? It'll be here when I get back. Um, what potion? What are you guys talking about? Oh, no, <laughs> nothing. She's, don't, don't listen to her. She doesn't know what she's talking about. Molly! Uh, don't worry about the potion. It's just, just a little experiment we're trying. Oh, no, Molly. Don't tell me you're trying another one of your experiments. This always ends bad. Let's just go look at the scooter. Come on. Wow, Blucky, your new scooter is amazing. I love the color. The yellow is, is so awesome. Reminds me of lemonade. Ah, lemonade. One of my favorites. Along with cupcakes and cookies and pretty much anything sweet. You guys want to go for a ride? Me first! Daisy, don't fear. You're already sitting on it. Bye, Molly. See you later. Okay, just never go back now, Bucky, because she's kind of annoying, sister. What? I heard that. Rude. So wait a minute. I don't get a ride on the scooter? Well, she had to go down to the store for her mom and pick up some stuff from the grocery store. 
Wait, what? But but I wanted a ride. She'll come back later, Miley. Don't worry about it. Ugh, fine. Can't believe you got a ride on the scooter and I didn't. Grandma? Grandma? Where's Grandma? Oh, this looks delicious. What's this? Grandma! No! No! Grandma, don't drink that! OMG, Molly, she drank the potion! Ooh, this tastes really bad. Who made this hot cocoa? I know I taught you girls better than this on how to make hot cocoa. Grandma! Oh my gosh, Daisy. If that potion turns you older, then that means Grandma's gonna turn into a zombie. I mean, she can't get any older than she already is. OMG! She, she literally is gonna turn into a zombie. Oh, I feel really strange. Grandma, it's gonna be okay. I'm sorry you're a zombie. What? A zombie? I don't feel like a zombie. I know, it, it's gonna happen soon. The transformation, that is. Oh, <laughs> don't be silly. I feel like I have a lot more energy. What? What just... What just happened to me? Grandma? Oh my gosh, you just got younger! Wait a minute! Whoa, 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 whoa! I thought that potion made you older! Um, me too, but apparently, if you're already old, it makes you young and you age backwards. Whoa! That's kind of amazing! OMG! I could do about a thousand of these! <laughs> <sighs> I found the fountain of youth. I mean, it tasted terrible, but who cares? Whee! Oh, I'm gonna go run around the block. This is gonna be amazing. <coughs> but Grandma, your bad hips. What bad hips? I feel amazing. Grandma, wait, come back. <laughs> I'll be back in a minute. Whee! <laughs> so much fun. Uh, I don't even think I could run as fast as Grandma. Holy guacamole. I don't know what you put in that hot chocolate, but it's amazing! Whee! I'm never going back to being old, ever! Um, Daisy? We have a problem. Yeah, you got us into another world of troubles. Go figure. Daisy, I'm serious. What are we going to do about this? Well, it doesn't seem like a bad thing to me. I mean, Grandma's really happy about it. Ooh, I feel kind of funny. Like, you're going to get old and be a zombie? Or maybe end up in the cemetery? Oh, whew, I have to sit down for a minute. No, I don't feel old. I actually kind of feel, well, I don't know. Like, I'm getting younger. What? OMG! Daisy, I, I think she might get younger again! Whoa! I can't believe it! I, I turned back into a little kid! Grandma? Oh, boy. We're in some serious trouble now, Daisy. Correction, you're in some serious trouble, Molly. It was your potion. Yeah, except for the fact that, uh, you were right in the kitchen when I made it. Molly, how you gonna blame me? It was your idea. <laughs> you guys fight like cats and dogs. <laughs> it's kind of funny. Grandma, are you feeling okay? Who's your grandma? I'm not your grandma. My name's Lily. Um, okay, Lily, uh, you used to be my grandma. <laughs> Don't be ridiculous. I'm no one's grandma yet. I'm just a kid. Oh my gosh, Daisy, she has an amnesia too. She can't even remember that she was our grandma. Well, that makes sense because her brain is so young. Why would she want to be someone's grandma right now? She can't be someone's grandma, so her brain doesn't remember that she's someone's grandma. Um, okay, I think that made sense. Yeah, you know what I mean, Molly. <laughs> I'm gonna go jump on the bed and eat all these Reese cups. Actually, I just jump on the couch. That sounds fun. Um, we're not allowed to jump on the couch. Don't care. Whee! This is so much fun. Ooh, mm, this chocolate's delicious. I'm gonna get in the hot tub now. I'm gonna get in the hot tub. Uh, we're, wait, you're not supposed to get in the hot tub. Wait, Molly, um, she's breaking all the house rules. I know, she's like a bratty kid. I never knew my grandma was so bratty when she was a kid. Yeah, all those guilt trips she gave us about you need to be good kids and always listen. And she's being a total brat. Yeah, I guess it takes one to know one, huh? 
Exactly. Hey, get out of the hot tub or you're going to be grounded. You can't ground me. You're the same age as I am. I don't believe you. Who are you anyway? Get out of my house. This is my house. Don't you think that your house would be different than your granddaughter's? I already told you I'm not your grandma. Do I look like I'm super old like a zombie? Well, uh, five minutes ago you kind of did. Yeah, you were like so old. You, your hips didn't even work anymore. What are you guys talking about? You're being so crazy. Oh, I've got to go eat more snacks. I'm starving. Hey, wait a minute. Don't eat the, all of those snacks because you'll get a stomach ache. Yeah, that's it. You just want to eat them all yourself. That's why. And I'm not going to let you. Well, yeah, it's sort of that, too. <laughs> mm. This is like the best ice cream I've ever had. Give me back that ice cream. Ew, you want the ice cream after I've licked it? That's disgusting. Well, I'm just saying don't don't eat any more. Oh, my goodness. You're eating everything. Ooh, I feel kind of funny. Oh, no. Not this again. Not this again. <laughs> I bet. My mommy! <laughs> OMG! My grandma just turned into a baby! <sighs> now I have a toddler! I can't believe this! What am I gonna do? Well, Molly, maybe you shouldn't panic. Oh my gosh! Not panic! I'm panicking! I'm panicking! I'm panicking! I'm panicking! Molly, seriously, we gotta figure this out. If mom comes home and sees grandma as a toddler, what's she gonna think? I don't know. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad! All of your plans usually are, Molly. They usually are. Hey, this isn't a time to tease your sister. Well, there is that um, catalog of ancient spell books at the school library. Maybe that would have an answer. Oh, that's a great idea. Okay, come on, Lily. Or Grandma or whatever. I just want my mommy. <laughs> okay, I'll take you to your mommy. Come on, follow me. Oh, boy, I hope this works. I hope this works. Don't worry, Lily. We'll have this fixed in no time. And then you'll be back to your old self. Yeah, Molly, her old self. <laughs> you can say that again. Okay, well, let's go see if we can find some books in the library. I hope we can find something. How to turn your enemy into a toad. No. How to make blueberry jam. Seriously, that's in a spell book? Daisy, we've been looking through these spell books for hours and we can't find anything. I know, Molly. I feel like it's no use. You made a potion that is completely irreversible. Oh, this isn't good. This isn't good at all. Hey, wh where did Lily go? What? I thought you were watching her. No, I wasn't watching her. I thought you were watching her. Oh, no. The baby ran away. Oh, my gosh. And she's grandma baby. It's not just an ordinary baby. It's an old crib keeper granny baby person toddler. Molly, you're really getting confusing right now. I thought you were babysitting her. Well, I thought you were babysitting her. Now we lost granny baby. Well, let's go see if we can find her in quick. Holy guacamole. Lily. Lily. Where are you? Are you in the dumpster? Uh, no. Ew, it stinks in here, though. Lily! Lily, where are you? Lily! Oh, no. Who's calling me? Molly, I don't know. Maybe it's the police and they found Lily. Maybe, but I doubt it. Hello? Oh, hey, Molly. What's up? Oh, hi, Mom. Um, not much. Uh, you know, just hanging out with Grandma. Oh, okay, well, that sounds fun. Um, I'll be home in ten minutes. Ten minutes? What? What are you talking about? Um, I thought you'd be excited I was coming home from the office early. Maybe we could go to the water park? Uh, no, no. No, I'm good. You could stay at the office. Molly, you seem suspicious. Molly, I'll be home in ten minutes, okay? Okay! Daisy, we have to get home! But what about Lily? I don't know. We're gonna have to tell Mom. We've got to be home, though, when she's home. Or she's going to be really mad. And she's going to ground us, like, forever. Well, Molly, at least go the right way, then. Oh, whoopsie. <laughs> We're probably going to be grounded for the rest of our lives. Well, I mean, it's not that bad. We gave Grandma a new lease on life. Oh, boy. Yeah, we're definitely getting grounded forever. <laughs> Dizzy, what's that sound? Sounds like someone's sleeping. Oh 
my gosh! Look, it's Lily! She's sleeping under the coffee table! That's a weird place to sleep. Not if you're a toddler. Basically, you can fall asleep anywhere. OMG! I just had a huge idea! Oh boy, not again. I can't deal with any more of your ideas, Molly. No, seriously, Daisy. We we could give Grandma some more of the potion. Oh, yeah, because that worked out so well for us beforehand. No, seriously. If we give Grandma the potion, it should change her back. How do you figure, Molly? It, it worked backwards. Yeah, if you're old already, it makes you young. If you're young, it makes you old. And now Grandma's young. <gasps> Molly, so it'll make her old again. That's right, but we need to give her a double dose because Granny was really old. Ew, this stuff smells horrible. Oh, Lily, wake up. I want my mommy. <laughs> Lily, it's going to be okay. I made some delicious hot chocolate. Ooh, hot chocolate. That's right. You want it? Here you go. Ooh, it tastes bad. Drink it all anyway. Molly, don't be rude. You got to drink it all. I don't want to drink it. Well, you got to drink it. You have to. Oh, boy, Molly, you're a bad babysitter. Well, good thing she's actually our babysitter. Oh, you're funny. You feel super funny. Oh, my hips. They hurt so bad. Where's my wheelchair? Grandma? Oh, I'm so happy to see you. I think my memory might be going a little crazy because I don't remember what happened today. Oh. Grandma, uh, no big deal. You just fell asleep, that's all. Yeah, Grandma, we're just so happy to have you back. Back? Where'd I go? Back from La La Land when you were sleeping. <laughs> from your dreams, of course. You girls are acting so peculiar today. <laughs> yeah, sure, Grandma, sure. Hi, guys, I'm home. Oh, <laughs> hi, Grandma. Oh, hi, dear. Yes, they were perfectly good little angels. Mom, hi, you're home. Uh-huh, I told you 10 minutes. What'd you guys do today? Did you have uh, anything fun to do? Nah, it was totally an ordinary day. Right, Daisy? Yeah, boring even. Totally ordinary. Oh, yes, very ordinary. Except for the fact I can't remember most of it. What did you say, Grandma? She didn't say anything. Totally ordinary. Okay, well, Grandma, you gotta go home now. Thanks for watching us. <laughs> See you next time. Oh, I'm just glad you girls had such a boring, ordinary day. Yeah, <laughs> me too. Whew, that was a close one. Hey guys, what's up? Once you all take a seat, we'll get started. Started with what? Teaching us how to rob banks? I am in charge here. What? No, you're not. <laughs> yes, I am the CEO of Bank Robbery. Is she for real right now? Totally, I'm totally for real. I am an expert at robbing banks. Uh, Daisy, all that makes you is a criminal. <laughs> yeah, exactly. All right, let's get down to business. Where is this guy? Oh, there he is. Okay. Um, you look like maybe you've stolen from a lot of banks. Marley, that's rude. Today, we'll be robbing the city bank. <laughs> there is said to be five million dollars in the vault. Five million dollars? That's all? Like, seriously? Wouldn't five billion be better? Our mission is to grab the most money we can and escape alive. That sounds easy peasy. As long as you guys follow my lead, we'll be fine. I'm an expert at bank robbery. Are you really, Daisy? But not in real life, of course. It's just Roblox. There will be armed guards. Dun, dun, dun. Okay, that was a bit dramatic. Any questions? Um, yeah, I've got a lot of questions. What's the plan? Uh, you just follow me. I, I have a question, too. Wh where's our gear? Yeah, I have that question as well. Yeah, you're not doing a very good job, bank robber, leader, teacher, person. <laughs> Molly. I was just about to show you. I mean, hold on. Well, I've got a first aid kit in case anybody trips over a giant diamond and uh, um, falls down or something. What? What are you even talking about? Uh, uh, we won't. We won't what? Wait, I missed the conversation! Daisy! You're making me fail this class. Like you don't fail in every other class. I don't! I don't fail! 
Okay, everybody, good. Follow me. Okay, I don't have any idea what's going on. You never do, Molly. You never do. Hop on, everybody. Ooh, we're taking this elevator into the bank. How cool. We're going down an elevator to rob a bank. Ooh la la, this is going to be a hard one to rob. Uh, no, I... Oh, gosh, those guys look scary. But this is also so cool! How do I get these? Oh, wow. 400 Robux. Meh, I think I'll just take my chances. Take a minute to look around. 199. Um, I don't, I don't think I need the jelly gun. Jelly gun? What are you talking about, Molly? Um, there's a gun in here that shoots grape jelly. How's that gonna help us steal the diamond? Don't ask me. I don't know. Um, Daisy? Molly, look at you! You look like a criminal! What about this guy over here? Holy guacamole, he's creepy. I think I'm gonna be this guy. What guy is that, Molly? Criminal that steals diamonds? Hey, it's Roblox! Anything can happen! Okay, we looked around for a minute. No, we don't want to buy your cheap jelly guns. Now what? Now I think we have to... What? Grab a uniform. Did that! This guy is so behind on what's going on. Yeah, he's a pretty bad bank wobble. I'm going to be much better. I'm going to be the best wobble in the world! <laughs> OMG, Daisy, that was so creepy! Daisy, how come how come you have that look on your face? What, this one? It's because I'm so shocked that we're about to steal the biggest diamond in all of Roblox. I know, right? This is going to be crazy. Wow, look at this armored car. This is kind of cool. Sweet. You guys look awesome. Great job. Uh-huh. You will all receive pistols when we get to the bank. Wait, we're not in the bank? No, Molly, we're just at the warehouse getting propelled. You should take one of these guns, too. It'll help you. Help me what? Rob the diamond! Come on, everybody, we leave in one minute. Okay, well, I guess I'm gonna ride on the top of the truck. <laughs> hey, guys! Um, while we're waiting to rob this bank, I think it would be a good time to tell you about our new website, starsquad.shop, where you can get t-shirts with the Star Squad on them, piggy shirts, pillows, backpacks, and more. So if you guys want to, you can check it out by clicking the link in the description box below this video. Whoa! What else is there to do up here? Molly, get back here or they're going to leave without you. Uh-oh. Holy guacamole. I better get down to this armored truck. <laughs> I like the license plate. Tough! <laughs> yeah, you have to be tough if you're going to rob a bank. No kidding, Molly Jeepers. Enter the van. Okay, I entered it. Now what? Now, shh! Molly, we're on a top secret mission. Okay, if you say so. Oh my gosh! This van goes so... <laughs> Why, Molly? It only went five miles an hour. All right, everybody get in the van. No way! That stinky van? I, I'd rather run there. It's so slow. Yeah, no kidding. Here we are. Um, yeah. Okay, wait. They flipped the switch. These guys are like seasoned criminals. They know exactly what they're doing. Those cameras are the problem. Uh, yeah. Hello, Slowpoke. We already cha changed them and turned them off. But they won't let us in unless we take out the cameras. We already took... Uh, is this guy even listening? Hello? On each side of the building, there are power levers. Uh-huh. We know. Oh, wait. There's still one more camera. This guy's smarter than we thought. Disable the cameras and we can go in. We're gonna steal the biggest diamond in the world. We're gonna steal the biggest diamond in the world. Do you have to sing about it, Molly? Yeah, don't let the camera see you. I will, Molly. I'm incognito. Flip the switch, Daisy. Flip it. I did, Molly. Nice job, Daisy. Now we can go steal that diamond. 
We're gonna steal a diamond. You guys ready? Ready as I'll ever be to be a criminal. I mean, <laughs> how can you be ready to be a criminal? Yeah, I'm ready. He's very excited about being a criminal. I noticed. Good. Does anybody else notice this guy is like really slow to say anything to us? I know, right, Molly? What is going on? It's almost like he's not really here. I think he might be like a robot or something. Let's go into the bank and rob this diamond! The biggest diamond in all of Roblox. Okay, maybe we have to keep going. Oh, uh, guys, I'm just keep. G oh my god. There's some serious lasers down here. Um, problem with the diamond. We're all gonna die! What a nap. We're not gonna die. I'm just gonna shoot holes in the wall. Bam, 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 bam. Um, guys, how is that going to help? I don't know, but I just want to. I got a gun too. Wait, do I have a gun? Oh, yeah, okay, I do. Bam, 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 bam. I'm gonna take out that light. Bam, bam, bam. <laughs> just kidding, people. Just kidding. Ow! Why are you shooting me in the butt right now? Ow! Oh, my gosh. Seriously? Hmm, I didn't see us coming through this, though. Really? You couldn't have imagined there'd be lasers in this bank? Be very careful. Duh! You have to go through these lasers. Um. We have to disable them for this, this guy so that he can go in and steal the diamond. Whoa. <laughs> oh, no! Oh, my God! I just died! Well, Molly, great. Now you gotta spend 35 little bucks. Wait, what, where is everybody? Ah! I've turned into the leader! Just just kidding. It's just me. Okay, great job, everybody. Really? You didn't have to jump through the lasers? You just waited for us? <sighs> Daisy, what are you doing? I'm shooting jelly at this guy. He's being rude. Daisy, stop it. No, I'm just kidding. I've got to disable all these lasers. This is going to be big! Okay, let's do this then. Stand back! Oh, he's blowing it up. Okay, everybody stand back. Whoa! He really blew that up! Holy cow. Whoa, there's a lot of money in here. I want all the money. Oh, taking stacks of cash! Stacks of cash! Look at me taking stacks of cash! Only in Roblox, go. I'm a good person in real life. I only rob banks in Roblox. Oh my gosh! Loving all this money. Maddie, stop singing and take more cash. Stacks of cash. Stacks of cash. Molly. <laughs> ah, someone's shooting at me. I'm going to die. Oh, my God. It's the army, guys. Oh, my God. Don't worry, Molly. I don't have a gun. Um, Anybody know why? Because you die. Uh-oh. Do I get a taser? No, Molly. You're not a cop. You're the bad guy. Oh, no. Oh, Daisy! <laughs> oh, my God! You got them both. Now, let's steal all the cash and get out of here. My sister wasn't kidding when she said she was a total criminal. It's criminal how easy this game is for you, Daisy. Hey, what can I say? I'm, being, I'm good at being a Roblox thief. Get the rest of the money. We're not sharing it with you. You're lazy. You didn't do anything. Take all the money. Yeah, yep, yep. Oh, yeah. Oh, my gosh. This is a lot of money. Uh, where am I putting it all? Like, literally, I have no bag or anything. This won't all fit in my pockets. <laughs> I'm eating it. Just kidding. <laughs> yum, 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 yum. Ew, Molly. Yeah, that would, that would be really gross. Hey, stop stealing my money. Okay, let's hurry and get out of here. Okay, let's do this. Oh, there's the leader. Oh my god, they know we're here! Really? Of course they do, we're robbing a bank! We have to leave a different way. This is going to be nasty, but... Well, I don't have a gun, so I'm, what am I supposed to do? 
I guess just let me handle everything, Molly. Jump in the sewer! Ew, that's gonna be gross! No, I don't want to jump in the sewer, please. No. Just no. Well, Molly, you gotta do what you gotta do when you're robbing banks. I didn't see a big diamond anywhere, did you? Not yet, Molly. Maybe it's not here yet. Ew, it stinks so bad down here! Yep, pretty stinky! Yeah, <laughs> I didn't really want for this to happen, but, you know, <laughs> you gotta do what you gotta do, right? Um, just face it, you didn't plan at all for this, did you? How did we get out of here? Yeah, do you even know how to get out of here? Uh, well, um, uh, I'm not sure. Seriously, you put us down here and you don't even know how to get out? Ugh, we are not gonna ever get out of this sewer. Now we live down here. We live here! Look for a way out! Watch out for the guards! Oh, that's good. I don't even have a, my pistol anymore. Now what am I going to do? Oh, that's just Daisy. <laughs> Literally, I thought well, that was one of the guards. Okay, I don't see any of the guards anywhere. Me either, Molly. Me either. Let's go see if we can find somebody. No, we do want to find somebody, Molly. We want to get out of here. Yeah, let's try to get out of here. Oh my god, I found a guard! Don't worry, Molly! I'll take care of it. Okay. I'll stand over here and, like, the leader. Do absolutely nothing! I got it, Molly. Okay, now how do we get out of here? I don't know, but follow me. I feel like I know the way. We're gonna be stuck in here forever! Quit being so dramatic, Molly. Jeez. Well, seriously, it stinks like poo poo in here! And, and I want my mommy! Oh, who I know how to get stuck in the sewers with you? Ah! There's the way out! Uh, there's also a guard. Uh, he fell over. They're just robots, Molly. Seriously, what just happened? I, I can't see anything. Our escape driver should be here any minute. That's good, but where's the big diamond? Uh, must have been another bank. Hey, what was that noise? Come over here, Molly. We don't want to get caught. Oh, no. It's the police. What? Seriously? Oh, brother, Molly. Now we're in trouble. We don't have long. Yeah, you, you could have said that beforehand since you didn't plan any of this out. Well, Molly, he's a terrible leader, but now we have to get out. He's too late. We have to fight. I don't even see any of the cops. Where are they? Take out all of the guards. Oh my gosh, there they are. I'm just gonna hide over here because I don't even have a gun. Good plan, Molly. Oh wow, Daisy. <laughs> Daisy's like super criminal right now. Take that and that and that! We have to get out of this bank heist alive. Okay, Daisy, if you say so. Bing, 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 bing. Take that and that and that! Molly! When I respawned into the game, I don't have a gun. What? I don't have a gun either. Now what are we going to do? Um, well, uh, let's ask the leader. Okay, so what do we do? We don't have a gun. Oh, what are you talking about? I don't know you. What are you talking about? This was your idea. Oh, help. These guys are trying to rob me. Look, they're thieves. I'm just a nice businessman wearing my nice suit, going to work, and I'm not doing anything wrong. Are you kidding me right now? Oh, brother, he's a traitor! Daisy, this looks like the end for us. We're going to the big house. Jail! <laughs> mom! Mom! Mommy! Mom! 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 Mama! Mommy! 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 Mama! 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 Molly, what is going on? What's gotten into you? I have a question. Mom! 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 Okay, what is it, Molly? Um, can I have some ice cream? <coughs> Molly, no, you know it's right before dinner. Of course you can't have ice cream. But I'm hungry! Molly, dinner is in the oven. It'll be ready in 10 minutes. You can wait that long. No, I can't! I'm starving! Mom, help! <coughs> can't wait any longer! Send ice cream! Molly, you're being so dramatic right now. Whoa, Molly, are you okay? What happened? Uh, she wants to eat ice cream for dinner. I'll do a CPR! Dad, no! No! You need to send ice cream. I don't need CPR. You look like you might need CPR. 
Are you dying? Yeah, I'm totally dying without ice cream. It's not fair. I can't eat what I want. Why can't I make my own decisions? Because, Molly, you'd make bad ones. That's why you're a kid and I'm a grown-up. Oh, man. <laughs> Look at these adorable dogs. I love this. Dad, um, I can't do my homework. What? Why, why not? Um, Daisy's watching dog videos on the internet, and um, I need to use the computer for my homework, so guess I don't have to do it tonight. Molly, pff, whatever. You still have to do your homework. Ask Daisy nicely to get off the computer. I'm already off of it, Molly. It's all yours. Nah, I'm just going to skip it. Molly, no, you're not. The answer is no. Go do your homework. Ugh, the answer is always no, it seems. Ay, ay, ay. Something's wrong with the computer! Molly, you just have to learn how to use it. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that funny dog! It's smiling! <laughs> Molly, do your homework already. Family, dinner's ready! Huh, fine. I don't know why we can't eat chocolate ice cream instead. Because, Molly, you can't eat chocolate ice cream for dinner. Can I when we're on vacation? No. But, but it's vacation! Well, who cares? Right now it's not vacation, so just eat the cheeseburger I made you, please. It's delicious. I made it out of a veggie patty. What? <laughs> Ew, vegetables? No way! I love Mom's veggie patties. You would, Daisy. You would. Well, Molly, you're still eating it. Of course I am. I'm starving. What else is there to eat around here? Molly, could you stop yelling? You're so loud. Yeah, Molly, why don't you take it down just a notch? Ooh, I want to have ice cream for dinner. What? That, oh, 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 that, that's, that's not fair! Actually, it's very fair. <laughs> I'm a grown-up, so I can eat what I want. Dear, we're supposed to be setting a good example. Yeah, set a good example, Dad. Eat a veggie burger instead. Not a chance. I don't like those. They're gross. Hey, I worked hard on this dinner. Okay, bye. I'm going to watch TV. Uh, if only I could live a life like my dad. Mom! 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 Yes, girls? Oh, it's getting very late. You should get to bed. No, actually, Mom, now that we're done with dinner, I was wondering, can we go swimming in the pool? What? N no! It's almost midnight. You can't go swimming in the pool at midnight on a school night. <laughs> Molly, you're asking such crazy questions. What's wrong with you? Daisy, can I see you in the other room, please? What is it, Molly? Oh! M.G. Our parents say no to everything. Yeah, you do have a point there, Molly, but that's because you have crazy questions or crazy requests. But they're still my requests. Why do they have to say no to everything? Can they just say yes to one thing? Either ice cream for dinner or no homework or swimming at midnight? No, we can't say yes to anything, Molly. Oh my gosh, this is terrible. Mom, Dad, Daisy and I have decided something. We did? Wait a minute! I didn't know I was a part of this decision! What are we telling them? Wait, I don't want to get in trouble. It was all Molly's fault! Okay, girls, what is it? You guys say no to everything! Well, that's not true. We don't say no to you doing your homework, eating healthy... Exactly! Anything that's fun is off limits. I propose that we have one day that's a yes day. Hmm. I don't know, Dan. That doesn't sound like such a bad idea. Whoa, Molly, you kind of had a good idea for once. I know, right? Tomorrow, um, our parents can only say yes. Do you guys agree? Well, as long as it's nothing dangerous. What do you say, Dan? Oh, I don't see why we couldn't do that. All right, tomorrow is a yes day. Okay, well, it's already tomorrow because <laughs> it's almost 2 a.m. What? Go to bed. Tomorrow's school. Um, no. Tomorrow, I'm not going to school, okay? Oh. All right. Yes, you can stay home. Ha-ha! <laughs> skip day, skip day, skip day. And also, I'd like to stay up late. It's already late. Go to bed, Molly. Okay, I'll give you that. It is pretty late. But tomorrow, as soon as I wake up, <laughs> everything is a yes. Good morning, parents! Good morning, Molly. You're up pretty early for staying up so late. I'm so excited about today. I don't want the next 24 hours to pass me by while I'm sleeping. Wow, maybe every day we should say yes and get you out of bed on time. 
Yeah, well, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to make a mountain of waffles with chocolate ice cream on top. Whoa, <laughs> that sounds super unhealthy, Molly. Oh my gosh, I'm so tired. Yeah, doesn't matter if it's unhealthy. I get to eat it because today is a yes day. So can I have chocolate on top of my waffles? Mm, uh, uh. Okay, yes you can. Ha ha ha! Daisy, you want chocolate on top of your waffle? Absolutely, Molly. I'm still kind of tired. I could use an energy boost. Uh, Daisy, there's no laying on the counter. It's a yes day. You have to say yes, and I want to lay on the counter. Okay, yes, I guess you can. Mm. Okay, now I gotta get the waffle. Okay, let's see. I've got the ice cream. Just a little bit of waffle. Mm hmm. So delicious. Waffle, chocolate. Waffle, chocolate. Waffle, chocolate. Waffle, chocolate. Waffle, chocolate. Ugh, I ate too much. <laughs> I'm stuffed. What do we got to drink? Ooh, Bloxier, delicious. Molly, don't forget to shut the refrigerator door. I don't have to. It's not my day to do it. Molly, uh, Mom, I think you should su shut the refrigerator door. Ugh, Molly, really? Okay, I'll do it since it's a yes day. Daisy, are you ever going to wake up? We have important things to do. Come on, I want to ask you something. Okay, Molly, what is it? Well, so far we've had waffles with ice cream. But maybe we should ask for something bigger. Like what, Molly? Like what if we borrow Mom's car? What? She's never going to let us do that. She has to. It's a yes day. Oh, Mom! What is it now, Molly? I'm kind of afraid to ask. Can we um, borrow your car? What? No way. Are you crazy? Uh, Mom, don't forget. It's a yes day. Oh... All right, but be careful, okay? We will. Come on, Daisy. <laughs> I'm going to ride in Mom's car. I'm going to ride in Mom's car. It's going to be super amazing. Ooh, it's beautiful. Mom's car is so amazing. Yeah, except for she has to get that license plate changed. It still says gaming with Dan on it. Yeah, it's totally not Dad's, though. It's Mom's. He never drives it. Molly, it appears to me that you've never driven it all. Okay, I've never driven this car. I'm having a little bit of trouble with it. Ugh, ugh. Okay, I'm on the road. I'm good. Molly, watch out for that bush. Oh, my goodness. Oh, we gotta go over the bridge. Yeah, don't go down into the grass. Let's play some awesome music. P I G G Y. Piggy's after me. A P I G G Y. A piggy, won't you set me free? Molly, you're all over the road. Turn down the music. You're not paying attention. I'm totally paying attention. Molly, you just took out that sign. Molly, what are you doing? Whoa! 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 Oh my god, Daisy, I just put mom's car in the pool. OMG, Molly, get out, get out. Daisy, I can't. My door is stuck. Ah! Daisy, I'm going down with the fishes. Molly, there's no fishes in the pool. Oh my gosh, I'm going to be the only fish and I can't breathe underwater. Molly, just hang tight. I'll get out an axe. You just carry an axe around? Yeah, for emergencies, of course. Okay, step back, Molly. I don't know about this, Daisy. Molly, what's your alternative? Going to the bottom of the pool forever? Wait, I'm out. Daisy, you did it. Oh my gosh. Molly, how are we going to tell Mom about our car? Um, well, we could just, like, tell her that, uh... Uh, how can I word it so that she has to say yes, that this is okay? Hmm, let me think about this. We could say to her, um... Mom, you're totally fine with us crashing your Jeep into the, po the pool, right? And she'll have to say yes. That's genius! Mom, you have to be okay with us driving your jeep into the pot. I keep saying pond. Me too, Molly. <laughs> it's pool. Let's practice again. Mom, you're totally cool with me driving your jeep into the pool, right? Yes, I'm totally cool with it. Ah, this should be fine. Let's go home. Molly, I'm a little nervous. She's gonna freak out. I don't think so. I mean, she has to say yes. It's still the yes day. Oh boy, this might not go as planned. Hey, where's your mom's Jeep? I was going to take that to go over to the grocery store. 
Oh, uh, Mom let us borrow it. Oh, she did? Wait, what? She did? Yeah, she had to say yes, remember, because it's yes day? Oh, boy. I can't believe she let you drive her prized Jeep. She sure did. Okay, well, bye. Well, wait a minute. You guys are here and the Jeep's not. Where, where is it? Ah, uh, see you later, Dad. Oh, boy. That didn't go so good with Dad, Molly. How do you think it's going to go with Mom? I have no idea, but we're about to find out. Oh, hey, girls. How was your drive in my Jeep? Uh, it was amazing, Mom. Yeah, totally, except for the end. What do you mean, except for the end? <laughs> I didn't hear you girls pull in. Where, Where's the car? Um, uh, Molly, remember what we practiced? Oh, yeah. You're totally okay that I drove your Jeep into the pool, right? What? You what? Oh, my gosh, you drove my... Uh, wait a minute. You, you're kidding, right? <laughs> you're kidding right now, right? <laughs> you're just teasing me, right? You're pranking me? No, Mom, it's a yes day, so you have to be fine that we drove your Jeep into the pool. Wait, you really did drive my Jeep into the pool? Uh, yes? Oh, I don't like yes day anymore. Well, Mom, I can see that you want to take a nap in the kitchen right now, so I know you're really tired from doing the dishes all the time and stuff. Could I have a $1,000? What? She's gone insane, Daisy! Well, in her defense, yes day hasn't gone so well for her. Does that mean I can have a thousand dollars? I guess that means yes, since it's a yes day. Thanks, Mom! I got all the cash money! I got all the cash money! Molly, what are you gonna do with that much money anyway? Um Duh! I'm gonna go to the ice cream store and I'm gonna buy all the ice cream in the world. What? Seriously? <laughs> Don't worry, Mom. I'll bring you back a mint chocolate chip. I know it's your favorite. Okay, sorry. I'm just gonna step over you. Sorry. Uh, yeah. We might be able to get your Jeep out of the pool later. But first, we're gonna go to the ice cream shop. Whoa. <laughs> There's Mom's Jeep. Oh, well. It was a nice Jeep while we knew it. Molly, she's not going to be happy tomorrow when that um, Jeep isn't out of the pool yet. Well, if she wants it out of the pool, then she needs to work on getting it out of there. Oh, boy. Yeah. Good thing it's a yes day because we'd be grounded otherwise. Wait, why isn't anybody here? I don't know, Molly. Maybe they're on their afternoon break. Okay, well, I'm just going to leave the money right here. I'm going to take all the ice cream. Seriously, Molly? Yep, pretty much. You start with some bubble gum. Mmm. So good. Then I'm going to have some birthday cake. Mm. So good. Then I'm going to have some mint chocolate chip. Super delicious. Oh, I forgot about the vanilla. Molly, you're going to get a stomach ache. No, I'm not. I dare you. I can eat more ice cream than you. We'll have to see about that one, Molly. Ooh, chocolate. Mm. Mm. So good. Molly, did you eat $1,000 worth yet? Not even close. Why did we eat all that ice cream? Ugh. I know. I'm definitely going to throw up. Definitely. Uh, I've got to go to the bathroom. Where's their bathroom? Molly, I don't think there is a bathroom. What? No. Ugh. Molly, maybe this yes day wasn't such a good idea. What? Don't talk like that, Daisy. Well, I mean, we drove the Jeep into the pool. And we ate too much ice cream. Maybe our parents knew what was good for us all along. What? I'll never, I'll never surrender to that idea. Ever! Molly, I think I'm going to be sick. Uh, uh, me too. Uh, so much ice cream. Molly, get off of me. Why are you laying on me? Sorry. I just, I was trying to get to the bathroom so I could bleh. Ew, Molly, gross. I don't want any more yes days. Never again. I don't know what you're talking about, Daisy. I'm going to have a yes day again tomorrow. Well, you could do it alone, Molly. This is just crazy. Ah, 
summer vacation. It doesn't get better than this. No school, no homework, no teachers, no Sarah. <laughs> yep, summer vacation sure is amazing. Mm. Not to mention all the snacks. Mm, Doritos, Reese's, donuts, uh, and all of my favorite shows. Uh, this box is so heavy. Uh, Dizzy, what are you doing moving out? I don't think I'd be so sad about that. Whatever, Molly. You miss me. You really would. Uh-huh, sure. Mm. Okay, let's see. I could pack some waffles. Yeah, they'll last a long time. And I could also pack... Oh, I've got a cake. I could put that in here. Daisy, wh what exactly are you doing? Oh, yeah, I could make burgers and I could take some soda and yeah, that would be good. Daisy, why are you taking all the food out of the refrigerator? I need that, you know. Molly, you could always go to the store in a few days and buy more. I don't have that luxury. Daisy, what are you talking about? Why do you have a box labeled food? Are you trying to steal all that food and put it in your room so I can't have any snacks? You know how I feel when you eat the last egg of waffle. Molly, I'm sorry, but everything's fine, but I can't talk right now. I'm very busy. Daisy! What? Daisy, what are you doing? Molly, everything's normal. Don't worry about it. Okay, let's see. I've just got to look up how to purify water. What? You can do it through a sock? Ew, gross. Well, maybe it's a clean sack. Daisy! Okay, something really weird is going on with my sister. I mean, maybe she's just prepping for summer camp or something, but I don't know. I, I don't think her summer camp is till August. Something really, really weird is going on here. Okay, well, I'm just gonna follow her. That's what I'll do. I'll follow her, and I'll sneak up, and I'll eavesdrop on her. See what she's doing. You have to be really quiet. Wait, she not in there? Where is she? Oh, wait, there she is. She's in the spare bedroom. What does she have? Go away. Molly, stop following me. Go away. Seriously, you made that sign as I was coming up the elevator? Yeah, Molly, I knew you were going to follow me. And I'm busy. Stay out. Okay, fine. Rude. I know she's up to something, and I'm going to catch her. In the meantime, though, I'm going to go swimming in the pool. Okay, where's my bathing suit? I've got to put on a really cute bathing suit because Luke might be coming over later, and we might be going swimming. But I'm going to go swimming until he gets here. What about this one? Oh, that's pretty cute. This is super cute. Uh, um, no, but there's not, I don't want to wear that one. Let me see. Oh my gosh, look at this monster outfit. <laughs> That's adorable. Where are all the bathing suits? I can't find them anywhere. Okay, this is super cute. I'm wearing this in the pool. It's adorable. Okay, my parents just put in a pool last summer and it is amazing. I love it so much. Ah, <sighs> this is the life. Summer vacations are pretty much amazing. Hmm, this donut's really good. Even if it is a little soggy from being in the pool. Molly, what are you doing to eating a donut in the pool? What are you doing with it? An axe? Daisy, why do you have an axe? Well, I asked first, why do you have a donut in the pool? Because I'm hungry. I'm always hungry. I don't care if the donut gets wet in the pool. I still want to eat it. You're going to get frosting in the pool. Ay, ay, ay. Sometimes I don't even know how you're my sister. Daisy, wait. Come back here. What? Where are you going with that axe? Daisy. Daisy. Where'd she go? She is acting so Weird. All right, that's it. I'm gonna go find out exactly what she's doing. Daisy? Daisy, where are you? In your room? Daisy? Daisy? W w what's going on in your bedroom? Oh my gosh, Molly, this is my secret lab. How'd you get in here? Oh no, I must have left the door open. Hey guys, do you want to go to the park with me today? What? Nutty buddy, how are you in here? Oh my god, everybody's gonna know about my secret lab in, in Brookhaven. This is horrible. Uh, I think Nutty Buddy left. He's not really interested in a secret lab. He just probably wanted to go get ice cream with Nutty Buddies on it, of course, because those are his favorite. That's why his nickname is Nutty Buddy. Whatever, Molly, get out of my room. Get out of my lab. I'm busy. Daisy, seriously, what is going on in here? I mean, I knew you wanted to be a scientist and everything, but look at this place. Molly, I didn't want to have to tell you this, but I created a spaceship. What? You did? Yeah, Molly, and well, um... <sighs> I'm going to Mars. What? No, you're not. Don't say that. We have school in two months. You have to be here for it. You'll be back in time for that, right? <laughs> this is just like Mars summer camp. No, Molly. Once you go to Mars, there's no returning. What? What are you talking about? It's a one-way trip, Molly. I leave tomorrow morning. But... But Daisy, we're, we're sisters. You can't just leave forever. Molly, this is what scientists do. I'm sorry, but this has been a lifelong dream for me, and, and I have to fulfill it. Daisy! But, 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 but I'll never see you again. We have today, Molly. We have today. And then I'm off to uh, learn about aliens and, and, and Mars and... And all sorts of really cool things. It'll be a totally different life than here. I know, but here is a good life. Brookhaven, us, our family. Molly, 
I'm sorry, but this is what I want to do. Can't you be happy for me? Okay, I, I guess I'll try. We still have today, Molly. It's my last day on planet Earth. Let's make it the best one. Now, come on. What should we do first? Um, well, we should probably start with ice cream. <laughs> Since you won't be able to eat any on Mars, that is. Good idea, Molly. Let's go. Last one to the ice cream shop's a rotten egg. <laughs> She's always the rotten egg. Whatever, Molly. You're the stinky one. Hello there. <laughs> How are you doing today? I'm real good. Although it looks like Brookhaven's going to get a giant storm. Oh, no. Don't tell me it's going to flood again. Well, there are some pretty dark clouds out there. It's probably going to flood. Oh, man. I don't want my ice cream shop to get flooded again. <sighs> what can I get for you? Um, hmm. Oh, my favorite. Mint chip, please. Okay, one mint chip coming right up. Mm, that's delicious. And what about for you? Birthday cake, please. Ooh, delicious. Well, enjoy it, Daisy. It's your last ice cream ever. Why? Are you dairy intolerant? <laughs> I have some dairy-free sherbet if you like it. Ew, sherbet could never compare to ice cream. Well, it's all we have for the lactose intolerant. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> dairy is pretty wonderful. No, I'm not lactose intolerant. You see, it's my last... Well, you wouldn't understand. I just can't have ice cream anymore, okay? Um, okay, well, enjoy. Oh, excuse me, are you gonna pay for that? Oh, yeah, pay. I forgot about that. Here you go. Thank you very much. Enjoy your ice cream. Come on, Daisy, let's go sit over here. Our favorite booth. Daisy... Are you sure you want to go to Mars? I mean, I think everyone here in Brookhaven's going to miss you. Yeah, but right, Molly, you're my sister, and I annoy you always. I don't think um, you're going to miss me at all. Correction, Daisy. I might miss you a little bit. Wow, Molly, really? Yeah, but just a little. Hmm. Best ice cream ever. I couldn't agree more, Molly. Mine's already gone. Well, do you want a second one? I mean, it is your last day at the ice cream shop forever. Nah, I don't need a stomach ache when I'm on the spaceship tomorrow morning. Last one to the slide is a rotten egg. Molly, enough with the rotten eggs already. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> Molly, now you smell like a rotten egg. Ew. Sorry. Ha ha, I get to go first. Whee! No fair. Whoa. <laughs> Okay, that was so fun. We should do it again, Daisy. One more time, Molly. Then I want to play hide and seek. I don't know if they like playing hide and seek on Mars. Good point, Daisy. They may not. Whoa. And you won't have a sister anymore to play hide and seek with. Maybe the aliens will play hide and seek with you. <gasps> Maybe you could teach them how to play hide and seek. Good idea, Molly. That could be the first game I teach them. Okay, Daisy, who wants to be it? Not me, Molly. Okay, fine. But how about we have a rule? You could only hide somewhere in downtown. Because you only have so many hours left and... Well, you know, I I, I, I want to be able to find you before you leave on your spaceship. Good point, Molly. Okay, go count. And no peeking. Okay. One, two, three. Should I peek? I really want to cheat. <laughs> Four, five, six. I better not cheat, though, because it's the last time she's playing hide and seek, so. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Ready or not, here I come. Daisy, where are you? Okay, I can't find her anywhere. I wonder if she went into one of the stores or something. Daisy, are you in the fountain? You'll never find me. You'll never find me. Like guacamole. She's... Wait. Wait a minute. Does that plant have feet? Daisy! I found you! Oh, man. I should have hit battle. I thought maybe you wouldn't find me, but my feet have grown like 10 inches in the last year, so they stick out of everything. <laughs> you do have big feet, Daisy. No no offense or anything. Molly! Hopefully the aliens have big enough shoes for your big feet, because you can't come back to Earth to get new shoes. <gasps> Good point, Molly. I need to pack an extra pair of shoes. Wow. I'm getting hungry. Again, Molly? We just ate that ice cream like two hours ago. Don't you want to have a diner feast before you go to Mars? Ooh, that does sound good. Daisy, what if all they have at Mars is like slime and ooze and green goo? Well, I guess I'll have to learn to like slime and ooze and green goo. Ugh, gross. Well... If it's good enough to for the Martians, it's good enough for me. Hey, honeys. How are you doing today? Well, it's it's an okay day. Oh, you sound really sad and down. What, what's wrong? It's my sister's last day on planet Earth. What? Seriously? Oh, my God. You're going to die? I'll be sure to come and leave flowers for you at the Brookhaven Cemetery. No, no, no. She's not going to die. She's just a famous scientist, and she's taking her, her rocket ship all the way to Mars. Molly... I wasn't supposed to tell anybody. She's just a waitress. She, she won't tell anybody, right? Molly, she's gonna tell everyone. 
every customer that she's ever known. Well, there's no other customers in the diner right now, so we're safe. You'll be gone by the time another customer comes in. Wait a minute. You're going to be gone really soon. Daisy, are you sure you want to do this? I'm sorry. I'm trying to interrupt here, but if you want to eat before she leaves, I really do need your order. Okay, I have a burger and a soda, please. Me too. Sounds delicious. Want to have a full tummy for my ride? Okay, sounds good. Coming right up. Daisy, I hate to admit this, but you're my sister. I love you. Don't go. Molly, I'm sorry, but I have to do this. Science needs me. It's it's my fate in life. But what about being my sister? What about that fate? Molly, I'll always be your sister, whether I'm in Brookhaven or on Mars. Daisy, I don't want you to go. Don't go, Daisy. Please. Daisy, don't do this to me. <laughs> Daisy. Please don't go! <laughs> Please don't do this to me! <laughs> Molly, everything's gonna be okay. You're a tough girl. You're gonna be alright without me. But will you be alright with me? I'm um, sorry to interrupt, but here's your order. Enjoy! Okay, here's your tip. Just, just leave me alone, okay? Okay, no need to be grumpy. Sorry, it's just my last minute with my sister on the planet. <laughs> Well, Molly, you should eat this burger. It's really good. Daisy, aren't you sad? Um, Molly, I'm a little sad, but I'm mostly just excited. I'm going to Mars. I'm going to Mars. Gonna meet some aliens. That's the last Coke you'll ever drink. Ooh, yeah. That is super sad. Really? You're gonna cry about the Coca-Cola? But you're not gonna cry about me, your sister? Uh, well, uh, 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 Daisy! Well, Molly, it's about time for me to go. I hate to say goodbye, but goodbye! Daisy! What? Wait, up! Uh Daisy, I, I did, Daisy, wait a minute. Okay, fine, Molly. What, what is it? I'm not good with goodbyes. Daisy, I know we haven't always got along, but I really love you as my sister. Molly, I really love you as my sister too. I've been trying to stay completely positive about this trip, but the truth is, I'm gonna miss everybody in Brookhaven. Yeah, but you have to go to Mars. Like you said, it's your fate. But you don't have to. You can stay here. No, Molly, I have to go. Now turn around. That way you don't have to watch me leave. Okay. Goodbye, Daisy. Goodbye, Molly. Goodbye forever. Daisy? Wait. Daisy? Daisy! <laughs> well, here goes nothing. All my work as a scientist is finally led up to this. I even made a special helmet that would allow me to wear my pigtails. They're my signature style. Hee <laughs> hee. Whoa, a little bit of turbulence here as I leave Earth's atmosphere. This is crazy and amazing. Ah, little does my sister know that I packed all the Doritos in the house. Well, I guess you could go to the store, and I don't think there's a Dorito store on Mars, so, you know, I needed them. It's been one whole day since... Since Daisy left. And I just I don't even know what to do with myself right now. I guess I could go to the diner and get some lunch. That's what she would want me to do. Okay, maybe not. But that's exactly what I want to do. Excuse me, can I get some service over here? Oh, sorry. <laughs> I just came on for my lunch shift. What's wrong, cutie? Um, can you not sit on the counter? Well, I'm trying to sit on the chair, but it won't let me. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, you have to pull the stool out before you sit down. Uh, you really are having a rough day. I'm having a horrible day. <laughs> What's wrong, cutie? Oh, wait a minute. Now I remember. Your sister left for Mars, didn't she? Mm, this donut's delicious. Hey, are you giving me some lunch or what? Sorry, I had to work so late last night and then someone called off, so I had to work a second shift and I'm just really tired. I need like so much coffee. Here you go. How about this for lunch? Well, I don't even think I'm hungry. I just miss my sister. We would eat here together all the time. Well, cutie, your life has to go on even if your sister's not here. I guess you're right, but I want to live without her. It's going to be okay, Molly. Just try going through your day like you normally would. Okay, well... I'm not really hungry. Well, that's a first. You really must be depressed. Totally. Oh, yeah, I could go down the big slide. My sister and I love doing that together. And I could still do it on my own. Here goes nothing. Ugh, that didn't seem very fun. Oh, wait, I know what I need to do. I'm gonna run over here. Perfect. Last one to the slides, a rotten egg. <laughs> I'm gonna beat everybody. I beat you. Wait. There's no one to even bait to the slide. There's no one to, to tease about being a rotten egg. It's just, it's just me, alone, without Daisy. <laughs> Daisy, are you, are you up there? 
I know you're somewhere amongst the stars. I miss you, Daisy, but I know you're living out your dream as a scientist. I hope the Martians are nice to you, and I'll miss you forever. I'll miss you always. You'll always, always be my sister. So you see, if you want to play hide and seek, you have to go hide somewhere, and then I try to find you. If I find you, then I win. I don't that, no, 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 I really miss playing hide and seek with Molly. <sighs> okay, let's go over this again. First you hide, then I find you. Hmm, be late for school and get a Starbucks coffee and a donut or be on time. Well, I guess I have to pick the coffee and donut because I'm starving. Hello, ding, ding, ding. Is anybody working? Hello? Ugh. Just when you're in a hurry. Okay, no problem. I'll just get the donut myself and leave the cash on the counter. Mmm, that's a good donut. Mmm, what's this, a fruit smoothie? Yes, please. <laughs> I'll have the strawberry. Okay, guess I'm just gonna ring myself up. Where is everybody today? I'm sorry, I'll be right out. I ate beans for dinner last night and I'm in the bathroom. No problem, I'll just leave the money on the counter. Uh, let's see, and I'll leave him a tip. Thank you. You didn't have to do that. I know I didn't wait on you. No, but I've had bean burritos. <laughs> and I know exactly how you feel. <laughs> Time for school, and I'm all fueled up. Because I ate a donut. I don't know why I'm singing that right now. Hey, guys, what's up? Molly, you missed the entire first period of school. Yeah, Molly, you're totally gonna get detention. What? No, I'm only a little bit late. Try by 45 minutes, Molly. You miss math class. Yeah, Molly. Oh, boy. You're never gonna learn, are you? I'm, I'm, okay, I really needed breakfast. Sorry, I don't know what to say. Get out of bed earlier, Molly. Jeepers. Now, come on. We have to go get to English class. Molly, hurry up. Get a seat before you leave for this class, too. What? Test today? Oh, man. Well, it could be worse, Molly. You could actually have not studied. Uh, well, uh, I, I may not have. Good morning, class. All right, everybody, um, today, as you can see on the board, we're going to have a test. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Yes, Molly, what is it? Good grief. I have to go to the bathroom. I have to go to the bathroom. I, um, uh, ate a rotten donut from Starbucks this morning, and I don't feel so good. <laughs> Ew, Molly! I'll be right back! I may not make it back to class in time. Yeah, that ought to do it. I'll get out of the test today. <laughs> now I just need to hide in the bathroom. What was that? Oh, my stomach, I guess, really is making funny noises. Jiminy Cricket! That sounds so creepy! What was that? Oh my god. There's definitely something out, out under the bathroom door. Oh, I see somebody. What is that? I don't see any legs. I just see. Wait a minute. Did they just come through the through the wall? Oh my god. It's I think it's a ghost. Okay, I'm just gonna pretend I can't see it. Nope. I'm gonna just hide back here on the back of the toilet, and there'll be no ghost! I I I, I don't think. No, no, I can't see you. I can't hear you either. La 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 la. I can't hear anything. La 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 la. Ah! It's a ghost, and I came face to face with it. Ah! Why is the door locked? Why is the door locked? Help me, Molly. Help me. Ah! What do you want? you want but i'm freaking out right now i want you to tell my story your story uh you're dead that's your story the end god now let me out of here i can't you have to tell my whole story i don't want to i don't want to but just no no means no oh but you have to 
or you'll be stuck in this bathroom forever. Ooh. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll listen to your story and I'll tell it to people. If you stop making that creeping ghost, creepy, gross, I can't even talk. Creepy ghost sound because literally I am freaking out. I can't help it. I am a ghost. It all began when... Wow! My first day of daycare! This is gonna be so much fun! Hi! Uh, uh, I'm Annabelle. Hi, I'm Molly! Have you gone to this daycare before? Uh, no, it's my first day and I, I'm looking for a best friend. Oh! <laughs> that sounds amazing! What's, what's a best friend? It's a friend that you have forever um, and they're your bestest one. Whoa, that sounds amazing. I need to look for a best friend, too. Oh, okay. Um, well, maybe we'll decide to be each other's best friends, or at least friends, because I don't have any friends yet. Oh, my sister is my friend. Her name is Daisy, but she got the stomach bug on the first day of daycare, so she couldn't come. She'll be here tomorrow, though. Oh, okay. Well, um, maybe I could, um, just be your best friend. Well, we'll have to see. <laughs> Hi, everybody! I'm Brookie! <laughs> wee! Whoa, she seems kind of insane and super fun! Wee, wee, wee! Do you want to be my best friend? We'll have so much fun together, I promise. We'll do everything together, and we'll eat donuts together, and we'll bounce on beds together, and, 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 and we'll play hide and seek together, and it'll be so much fun. Let's start by bouncing on this bed. Wee! <laughs> yeah, I'll be your best friend. What? No one will be my best friend, but who's going to be my best friend? Wee! <laughs> Wee! I feel so ignored. No one will be my best friend. I hate going to daycare. I hate it. Molly, did you just hear that? I thought someone was talking. Nah, it's just the two of us. BFFs forever. An assembly at school. Oh, boy, oh, boy. I can't wait. Oh my gosh. Uh, hi, uh, I, I'm performing today. What? Who are you? Oh, um, we we went to we went to daycare together. I've been in a lot of your classes at school. I have no idea who you are, but um I'm sure I've seen you around the elementary school. Not really. I have no idea who she is. Anyway, um I'm saving this scene for my best friend. It's okay. I I I'm actually performing today. Um I'm a singer. Whoa, cool. I don't know you, though. Brookie, where are you? Here I am, Molly. Oh, you saved me a seat. I knew you would. BFFs forever. Do you know this girl? Um, wait a minute. No, I don't. Guys, I sit right behind you in math class every day. Sorry, I, I don't know who you are. What's your name? Okay, everybody. First, we're going to have... Wait a minute. Where's all the students? All right, guys, come on. Get down here to the auditorium. We're going to have a little performance today by our awesome choir. Well, Brookie, I guess we're the first ones here. Yeah, I can't wait to see the choir perform. And that girl, she said she's going to do a solo. Okay, everybody, first up, we're going to have Annabelle performing. Who's Annabelle? Daisy, you finally made it, huh? Yeah, and I don't even know who Annabelle is. Me either. She must have just moved here. Um... Hi, I'm Annabelle, uh... Who are you? We don't even know you! Oh, I sit behind you in English class, uh... What? No, you don't! Yeah, exactly what I thought. Who is this person, anyway? Imposter! Um, no, I'm... Okay, I'm just gonna sing my song now. Somewhere over the rainbow... Boo! She stinks, and she doesn't even go to our school! <laughs> wow, that was harsh. I wish I wish I didn't even exist. I wish I was invisible that no one can see me. Oh wait, I already am. No one even knows I do exist. <laughs> wait a minute, what what's what's happening to me? I feel I feel really weird. No, no, I don't want to turn into an invisible person. I want to be seen. I want to have friends. <laughs> What's happened to me? Holy guacamole! N no one knew who you were and, 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 and you turned into a ghost? That's right. When someone ignores you for that long, 
you turn into, well, ooh. Okay, that's creeping me out. Stop it. Seriously, stop it already. I can't help it. I just want to be normal. Well, I'm not sure I can turn you back, Annabelle. I mean, you're kind of, well, a ghost. I know. Well, um, can those ghosts eat donuts? Because I still have some of mine. Really? You'd share with me? Absolutely. I mean, you seem like a friendly ghost, right? I think. Sure. I'll be friendly. <laughs> I'm super friendly. Okay. Leaving now. Please open the door. I can't tell anybody your story if, if I'm stuck in the bathroom. Okay. But don't forget to come back. Again. Okay. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Molly, where have you been? It's already lunchtime. Guys, you're never going to believe this. Believe what, Molly? It looks like you just saw a ghost. I did. In the girl's bathroom. What, was she taking a bath in the toilet? <laughs> uh, no, but she was super creepy. Molly. Don't forget about me. Whoa, what was that? That was a ghost in the bathroom. She said I have to tell you her story. Then she won't be forgotten. And maybe she won't be a ghost anymore. <clears throat> Excuse me, lunchroom. I have to tell you the story of Annabelle. Molly, I finally have a friend. Um, uh, yeah, <laughs> you're a friend, all right. A creepy one, but, um... Uh, I guess we can be friends. <sighs> this is the weirdest school day ever! Thanks so much, Luke, for inviting my sister and I over to play Roblox. Yeah, we love it so much. It's our favorite. Oh, he's playing Jailbreak. Ooh, Luke, this is one of my favorites. Ah, oh, I can't believe it. I just got trapped by that cop. Don't worry, I know how to beat this game. Wait a minute, you lost the connection to the game? What's going on? <gasps> Molly, maybe the internet stopped. No, you guys are not allowed to play Roblox all day. But, but mom, it's, it's my party. Yeah, it's his party. You are playing too much Roblox. What? There's no such thing as too much Roblox. Well, yeah, Molly, sometimes you have to go out and play. Yeah, but not at our party. Come on, can't we play? Please, please, please. Uh, no, you can't play. Ugh, you're a grumpy mom. Yeah, you're a grumpy mom. Come on, everybody, let's get out of here. We can go to my house and play. I don't think so. I've set up a bunch of booby traps so you can't get out. What? You really are a grumpy mom. Okay, I've got to get through these booby traps and get to my house. Ah, what? I died already? Yeah, watch out for that lava, Molly. It's a real killer. <laughs> you can say that again. Come on, party attendees. Come to my house where their Roblox never ends. Uh, this door is out of bounds. I think you should use the other door. Thanks, Luke. I'll try it. It worked. Oh, Daisy. Bummer, you died. Oh, I got two right and one wrong. There's microphones in here. This is so she can hear. Okay, Daisy, come this way, this way, and then over here, I think. Oh! No, it's the one all the way to the right, Daisy. Thank you, Molly. You're welcome. Now you don't have to die. You're so lucky. You're so lucky to have a nice sister like me, aren't you? I guess, Molly. You guess? Oh, no, not another locked door. Okay, how about this one? Come on, party attendees. Follow me. Whoa, Molly, look at these old TVs. This is what the dinosaurs used to play Roblox on. Daisy! They didn't have Roblox when dinosaurs were around. Woo! Look at these pretty flowers! Don't be tricked! There's probably one that's booby-trapped. You're probably right, Molly. You're probably right. Escaping the grumpy mom! We're gonna have to go into the cave! A cave? Um... This sounds like a bad idea. Yep! There's lava down here. Whoa, I almost fell in it. It melted the end of my shoe. Molly, stop jumping by me. Well, I'm trying to jump by you because I've got to escape. Duh. Uh-oh, that guy just died. Don't worry, Molly. I'm sure he'll make it to our party eventually. 
I hope we have enough snacks for everybody at our house since we weren't expecting all these people to come over. Me too. I mean, what did his mom expect us to do? Of course we're going to play Roblox. Oh my gosh, I just exploded. Did you see that? Yeah, Miley, that was crazy. Um, I don't get it. Oh, you just pushed me into some lava. It wasn't very nice, was it? Okay, Daisy made it. Maybe, okay, I don't get it, Daisy. Go to the end until I took it over. I tried that already. It didn't work. See, I just keep dying. Good job, Marley. You will my steal. Almost, but almost doesn't count. And this other party goer is like jumping right so close behind me. Go. Just go because every time you jump, every time I jump, you jump. And then I just, I feel like you're going to push me into the lava. <laughs> See, I just died. Marley, that had nothing to do with him. Don't even blame anybody else. Okay, okay. Wait a minute. Which way do I go? This way, Marley. I love Roblox. Yes, I do. I love Roblox. How about you? Do, do, do. I love Roblox. Yes, I do. I love Roblox. How about you? If you love Roblox, slam that like button. Come on. Sparkles the unicorn said to do it. <laughs> I bet she did, Marley. Um, where is this? Oh, this way, Daisy. Okay, no, never mind. Oh, no, there's a ton of people in here. You know what that's going to mean? What, Molly? It's going to mean everybody's in here and they're trapped. I am so confused. How do I get out of here right now? This way, everybody! Just everything looks the same. Ugh. I don't like it. It's too close in here. Do, 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 do. Yes, I made it! Okay, um, don't touch the steam. Good idea. Thanks, Luke. If it wasn't for you, Luke, man, we'd know. Oh, my goodness, someone didn't follow instructions. You've got to follow instructions, people. Follow instructions. Okay, somehow I got to get up onto this ladder. Okay, uh, what? I died? On what? Just, I don't know, Marty. You hit to it on the ladder, I guess. Oh, now I gotta go through the steam all over again. Someone else died too. Oh, tragedy. Tragedy! I think my unicorn's too fat. That's why we can't get through here. It's all your fault, unicorn! For some reason, I can't jump up onto this ladder. I don't know why, and it killed me when I tried. See? Okay, I jumped up there and it di I died. That doesn't even make any sense right now. Back through the steam I go. Okay, I don't get this part! Why is this doing this to me? Okay, I died again. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm gonna need to say Power of the Unicorn. Are you ready, guys? Power of the unicorn with a sparkly horn. Okay, unicorn, time to earn your keep. Not be a lazy unicorn. You already ate three of my math assignments. So you didn't even help me! Man, this grumpy mom sure did set up a lot of booby traps. <sighs> I'm really in the mood for pizza, too. And basically, um, there's no pizza down here. <laughs> I need pizza! Guys, if you could leave me a pizza emoji in the comment section below, it would be amazing. I might need it to get through this part of Roblox. Oh my gosh, finally! Oh, thank goodness. Finally, Molly, I thought it was going to take you all day. Oh, and then you died in the slime, seriously? Oh, I'm having a really bad day. This was supposed to be an amazing party, but here I am. Stuck with these booby traps from Grumpy Mom. Everybody get grumpy. Yeah, but not everybody sets up a bunch of booby traps with slime in the bottom. I kind of like slime. It's like ooey and gooey and s super gross. Um, whoops, I went the wrong way. You like slime? Yeah, but not this slime. This slime is deadly. The slime is poisonous. Oh, no, I was on the stair! Come on, Molly, we don't have a day. We're gonna eat pizza and play Roblox. I'm trying, okay? My unicorn's being lazy again. Molly, you know how to play Roblox. You don't need your unicorn. 
No, I always need my unicorn. Always! Isn't that right, Sparkles? Don't listen to her. Um, Molly, what's good, guys? Oh, we got eaten. We got eaten by Grumpy Mom. Ew, we've been eaten. Yeah, your mom is just having a really bad day. No wonder she didn't even get a cupcake today. I'd have a bad day, too. Ah! I just died in stomach acid. Gross! Me too, Molly. Me too. That part's really hard. Yeah, because there's lasers above you, and then that um, steak is, like, going sideways, so you can't even see where you're supposed to be going. I'll jump on the chicken leg. Don't touch the lasers. Okay, yes! I did it! Woohoo! Oh, gosh. I don't like what's going to happen next, Daisy. What do you think, Molly? I think that's going to be gross! Okay, I keep falling. Boing. Boing. <laughs> oh my gosh. There's so many ledges. Oh, I'm getting dizzy. Why is there so many ledges? Stop it. Stop it. Ew! It's poo poo. Why is there poo poo down here? You know why, Molly. You know why. I don't, I don't, I've got to close my eyes. I can't even look. Ew, gross. Did I make it? Yeah, Molly, you made it. Whoa! Oh my gosh, my unicorn. Are you okay? Your unicorn's okay, Molly. Hey, why are you, why are you, like, falling on me? I can't help it. It's a conveyor belt of death. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, I don't know where we are. Ew! <laughs> Gross. We're in the toilet. <laughs> Ew, we're in toilet water. Ew. I'm totally gonna need a bath before this party now. Oh, nice. You found a leak in the toilet. Yeah, gross. Thanks for us inviting us to your party. Um, that was super great. You're small enough to fit under that door. Go, go, go. Oh, my gosh. Are we out yet? Go through that mouse uh, hole over there. It'll take you right outside. Here's hoping, Marty. Here's hoping. Tell me about it, Daisy. Oh. Oh, I ran into the wall. Ah! Almost there, almost there. Molly, there's giant mice right here. You don't touch their tails. They are not friendly mice. How do you know? Maybe they're very friendly. Trust me, giant mice, not friendly. If I was a giant mouse, I'd be friendly. Oh, yeah? Well, these ones aren't. Look at Oh, I guess you gotta jump on the cheese. The cheese stands alone. The cheese stands alone. Oh my gosh, I've got a cheese stands alone. Molly, it didn't even make sense. <laughs> Who said all my songs have to make sense? Oh, brother. We gotta jump on this little cheese. Oh! Molly, I'm leaving! Daisy, you better not leave me here with these giant cheeses. This one smells like stinky feet. That would be you, Molly. You should probably take a bath. Oh, ha ha, Daisy! Ha ha! Do you guys have a sibling? Do you guys, um, drive each other nuts? My sister drives me crazy. Molly, that's not nice. Hey, look at it, look, I see the outside! Yeah! Molly, look at that, we can have a party! Ugh, okay, fine, you win! Just let me out, be out of here and have some cake. <laughs> I don't think so, lady. <laughs> hey guys, thanks so much for watching today. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you can be one of our number one fans. And leave us a comment too to tell us how much you like this video. Okay guys, we'll see you next time. Bye! Bye guys! Oh my gosh, I can't believe I actually got the job at Twilight Daycare. This is amazing! Daisy, I thought you were going to be a caretaker. No, I'm a baby, and I'm very sad about it. You look pretty happy to me. Well, baby's emotions are kind of crazy, okay? Can't help it. Okay, well, I'll pick you up, okay? And that'll make you feel much better, okay? I'm going to rock you to sleep. La, la, la. You're going to drop me, Molly. No, I'm not. I'm not going to drop you. I've got you. You could to drop me. I know it. Okay, I'm not going to drop you. Um, okay, I might drop you. Molly! <laughs> Sorry, I'm new at this job.
Okay, fine. You can cry if you want to, baby. Um, Molly, we try not to speak meanly to other um to the, all the kids here at daycare. Who said that? Oh, it's just our boss watching us through the cameras. She pretty much tries to, you know, just make sure we're taking good care of the babies and, you know. Okay, well, she was being kind of a crybaby. Molly food! Oh my gosh, that baby's drooling. Gross! <coughs> oh, Mia, don't cry. It's okay, Mia. All right, I'll pick you up. It's going to be all right. Here you go. Here's your pacifier. Oh, you better now? Okay, I'm gonna feed you some milk then. Okay, first I gotta take your pacifier out, then I'm gonna give you some milk. Here we go. Why won't it work? I'm oh my gosh, I don't know how to feed her anything. She's gonna be so upset now. Okay, I'm gonna check you out. Make sure that you don't have a wet diaper or anything. No, I think you're fine. I think you just need this bottle that I don't have. Okay, no problem. Here you go. You can have this pacifier back. Do, do, do. I just, I don't, I don't know how to fix you. Molly, try to be nice to the kids, okay? I know this is your first day. Okay, boss. Daisy, I don't know about this. I, I can't talk to you right now, Molly. I'm playing. Daisy, it looks a lot like you're drooling. Yeah, but look, I have it to win. Oh, that's great, but I think you need a napkin. You're drooling. Don't make it fun of me. Okay, fine. You can drool if you want to. Even if I want stuff, I'm not going to get picked up. Oh, I pick you up. Poor little baby. Oh, here you go. Here, I'll rock you. It's okay. Nobody loves me. Oh, that's not true. You're very loved. Everyone at, at Twilight Daycare loves you. Here you go. Oh. Do, do, do. Here's your passy. Please don't pee in your diaper. Maybe you, maybe you want to sit on this. You want to, do you want to play on this? Molly, I'm going to sit on that. Okay, fine. You can sit on it. Just take this very unhappy baby over here. Maybe she'd just like to play with some toys. Okay, here you go. Oh, how about this little monkey? This monkey looks fun. Or the unicorn or, you know, anything. Molly, this guy keeps twirling me around and it's making me feel sick to my stomach. Oh, well, tell him you don't like to be twirled around. What are you doing outside, baby? Come in here. Oh, I can't. The baby's outside. I can't get the baby inside. Okay. Um, I'm going to go figure out how to get the baby back inside. Oh, wow. This, this is a nice playground out here. Holy guacamole. I want to be a baby. Okay, that's it. I quit my job. I'm going to be a baby. Molly, you can't just decide you're going to be a baby. I do. I want to be a baby. I don't want it. This job is too hard. It's too hard. Ooh, a pool. <laughs> it's only like baby. It's baby sized though. Oh my gosh. I can't get back out. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Call the ambulance. I can't get out of the pool. Okay, there we go. <laughs> so Molly, what do you think of your new job? Um, Alex, I think it's kind of crazy. There's a lot of babies to take care of here. Yeah, tell me about it. I, I kind of like it, though, don't you? Yeah, Twilight Daycare is a pretty good job. I kind of just want to be a baby, though, so I can just, like, um, like, eat delicious food, cry a lot, you know. Well, you could always wish for it. Maybe your wish could come true. Okay! I don't like this is really going to work. I wish I could be a baby! Wait, what? It Did it work? Oh my gosh, it worked! Wait a minute, where's my hair? What happened to my hair? Oh, shh, little baby. Everything's gonna be okay. But I have no hair! Oh my gosh, it's making me very angry. Don't you dare put me in a crib! I don't, I don't wanna go to sleep right now! D don't you dare do it! Don't you dare! Ooh, you're a grumpy one. You definitely need some some time in, in a nap a nap crib. I don't wanna be in the nap crib! No, stop it. I'm angry. <laughs> I'm going to make you happy again. Or maybe I'll just leave you here and you can figure it out on your own. Just kidding. I'm back. <laughs> You're kind of funny. <laughs> Whoa, where are we going now? Wait, I, no, I don't need a diaper change. No. Let, let go of me. I don't want a diaper change. 
I'm sorry, Molly, but you definitely need a diaper change. Oh, man. <sighs> I don't, I don't want a diaper change. I'm not a baby anymore, but I would like my hair back. Could I have my hair, please? <laughs> I'm going to get away from you. <laughs> get back here, Molly. You need to have your diaper changed. I don't want my diaper changed. How do I get out of this lady's arms? Uh, uh, let go of me! I got things I gotta do! Mm -hmm. Time to sleep. Lady, do I look happy about the fact you're trying to make me go to sleep? See, you can't stay angry, though. <laughs> Stop running into me! Oh, that guy keeps running into us. Okay, can I just get down now, please? Please? Nope, sorry. I'm just gonna keep carrying you. Ugh. Wait, now where are we going? What? It's a Chuck E. Cheese up here. Yeah, okay. I I'm cool with you carrying me, Kim, because you're going to take me into the ball fit pit, and this is going to be so much fun. Okay, drop me, please. Drop me. Yay! <laughs> I'm going to go down a slide. Whee! <laughs> oh, I kind of fell on my face, though. Okay, stop. I don't want you to pick me up. I'm having fun. Let go of me. Ugh, let go. Stop it. Okay, this employee is getting annoying. How can I give her one star? I'm trying to escape her. I'm going to climb up the slide. <laughs> You're not my caregiver anymore. Go away. Molly, yes, I am. I don't care. Stop picking me up. Stop it. I don't want you to. Go away. I'm having fun in the ball pit. Whee! <laughs> oh, that was so fun. I can't get out. Oh, oh Daisy. Okay, I told you you needed my help. No. Now I'm out on my own. Goodbye. This one's a real pain. Medical room? Uh-uh, go not going in there. That's where you get a shot. I don't think so. Ooh, I could go in the office and work in here. I don't know. Ooh, look at these papers. Ooh, a big chair. Ooh. You guys can't find me. I'm up here by myself. <laughs> Getting in trouble. Wow, I crawl so slow. Oh, here comes Alex. I'm gonna go find Daisy. Daisy? Ah, my leg hurts. Nobody take me to the hospital. What? Your leg hurts? Are you serious? Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I I tried to care, but I'm so hungry. I'm like drooling. Kim, put me down. I need something to eat. Molly, if you just be patient, I'll take you into the kitchen and give you something to eat. I okay, fine, but hurry because I really. I really don't feel good. I want to go with my mom and mommy. Oh, it's okay. You need a bottle and then you need to... There you go. And then you just need to go night-night. Okay, I guess... I guess we're not... I guess we're not enemies anymore. Since you filled my belly with deliciousness. Now put me down! Wow, you're a very spirited little baby. Yeah. And I don't like it when you keep holding me. Go away. But I just fed you. We're supposed to be friends. I have to find my sister. Daisy, where are you? Daisy? Daisy? I can't find my sister, Daisy. Oh, my gosh, Kim! Huh. Okay, Kim, I'm getting you fired. That's it. Kim, I'm taking you to see Daisy. No, you're not. You're taking me back to the ball pit. I don't want to... Oh, my gosh. Okay, I, I'm going to have to go back to being a grown-up because Kim literally will not let me go. All right, I'm back to being a grown-up. Now I need to go find my sister because her leg was hurt and I need to take her to the hospital and help her. Nope, now my sister. I don't want a diaper change! Wee! Excuse me, that's my sister. What? No, um, this little girl, I'm responsible for her right now. No, that's my sister, Daisy! Let go of her, I'll take care of her. It's okay, Daisy, I'm right. Sorry, I'm responsible for her. No! Uh, stop! Oh my gosh. These other um, daycare workers are just crazy right now. He's, he's trying to take her into the kitchen. She doesn't want any. She's got a hurt leg. I'm trying to get away, Molly, but I can't. Excuse me. That is my sister, and I need to take care of her. Sorry, I'm making her a bottle right now. Maybe later. No, that's my sister. Give her to me. Ah! Oh, my gosh. She's... Ah! Ah! What? No, I've tried to pick her up. Oh, my gosh. This is just turned into a disaster. Now what am I doing? Apparently I'm doing something. I'm doing some Tai Chi. Oh, I'm done. <laughs> oh, finally I can pick up Daisy. Ah, you picked her up again. Okay, Twilight Daycare. This is insane. This is insane, Twilight Daycare. Restroom. You're going to get another diaper change. Oh, he's putting you in the sink. 
Um, guys, is it just me or this guy look a little bit crazy? Just a little. Okay, let go of my sister, please. Woo, a bear! Yeah, uh, okay, but I, I just want to take my sister home now. Never. You can't have your sister back. What? Yes, I can. Give her to me. She needs to take a nap. I know what's good for her. Okay, you got evil real quick. Hey, we go home! She's mine. <laughs> hey, crazy guy! Dr. Jekyll, Mr. Hyde, get back here. Molly, I don't know what to do. This guy won't leave me alone. Ha <laughs> ha! Finally, I got my sister. <sighs> Let's get out of here, Daisy. Twilight daycare is kind of crazy. Tell me about it, Molly. My leg still hurts. Don't worry, Daisy. I'll take you to the hospital and everything will be okay. <laughs> Not on my watch. Ah! This guy's gonna follow us! Somebody call the police! Ah! Marty, where you been? Come on! It's almost dinner time! Sorry, <laughs> I got hung up at school again. Why is that, Molly? Did you have dun, 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 detention? Me? <laughs> nah, I wouldn't have detention. <laughs> of course not. Yeah, right, Molly. You have detention at least Monday through Friday every single day. That's not true. I didn't have detention last Friday for the first time ever. Oh, brother. Daisy, aren't you so glad that it's not hot and like we can actually play outside right now? Totally, Molly. Except for you keep trying to run into me. Holy guacamole, Daisy! Are you serious? I totally just lost my balance and fell in the pool. <laughs> Molly, that was pretty funny. I'm going out here. You don't have enough space to do anything. Whee! Oh, hey, Molly. Oh, hey, uh, Myrtle. What are you guys up to? Um, we're just hanging out. I'm riding my bike. Daisy's trying to push me into the pool. <laughs> that sounds fun. Um, maybe <coughs> I can hang out with you guys. Um, sure. No problem. I mean, we don't ever really hang out at school, but hey, you want to have a race with us? Sure, that sounds super fun. Okay, Daisy, you're way ahead of us. You have to be back here. Okay, Marty Cheapers, I was just trying to get my bearings on where I was starting is all. Daisy, come on, we're young! You're so bossy, Marty! Oh, if I could pick a different sister model, I totally would. Yeah, I know what you mean. I have a brother. He's so annoying. Marty, you're ahead of us now. It's just my bike, okay? It kind of sticks out far. On your mark! Get set! Go! Uh, Daisy, you went the wrong way! Myrtle, you're not going to beat me this time. Um, I may, Molly. Ah, uh, achoo! Oh, wow, Myrtle, you sound really snuffly. Yeah, I just had this runny nose now for like three days. My throat is really scratchy. And, uh, achoo! Myrtle, you just sneezed right in my face! You know what that means? Um, no, what? Uh, you shared your germs with me? Gross. Oh, sorry about that. Um, well... It's time for me to take some more cough medicine. Bye! Ugh. Daisy, Myrtle has some sort of cold or flu. OMG! Did you wear your mask? Of course I didn't! I didn't know she had it! And then she sneezed right in my face! Oh, wow, gross. Girls, come on! It's time to come inside! Okay, Mom, we're coming! Hey, Daisy, look at this trick. I can jump up and down on my bike. Whoa, aren't you special? I think I am! I'm special, right, guys? Slam the like button if you think I'm special! You guys don't think I'm special? Why did you slam the like button? All right, I'm over it. I'm over it! But still, seriously, slam the like button. Okay, Molly, stay way far back from me. What are you wearing? Um, my hazmat suit in case you caught something from Myrtle. Whatever, Daisy. She was hanging out with you, too! Mom? Mom? Yes, girls, I'm just doing some dishes. Mom, I feel like every time I walk into this house, you're doing the same exact thing. Well, ah, that's what adulting's all about. Well, then I'm never growing up. Good plan, Molly. Well, your dad's going to be late from work. He had to work overtime. So I'm just going to make us some nice, delicious TV dinners. TV dinners? Ooh, I love them. Mom, uh, you might want to put on a mask around Molly. 
What? Why? Because Myrtle was out in the street and forgot to tell her that she actually has like a flu or something. And she sneezed right in Molly's face. Oh, ew, gross. All right, Molly, mask up, please. But mom, I'm at home. Don't care, Molly, still have to wear one. Oh my gosh, this is ridiculous. Yeah, if you don't want to get sick, um, or get anyone else sick, I mean you have to wear it. Okay, fine, I'm wearing my mask. Good, that's great. Hello, is anybody home? Ah, it's Myrtle, she's got germs. Uh, Myrtle, what are you doing inside our house right now? Oh, uh, Molly dropped her cell phone while we were having a race, so I'm just returning it to her. Nope, you can keep it, full of germs, full of germs, full of germs. Molly, don't be ridiculous. Well, just spray it down with some Lysol, it'll be fine. Ooh, I could take an awesome cold selfie of myself. Oh wait, my nose is kind of running gross. Ew! Oh, it's full of germs! It's full of germs! Here, Mom, you take it, you take it. Don't hand it to me, ew! Oh, Molly, why'd you hand it to me? It's full of germs! Here, Mom, I'll drop it in this bucket of bleach. That'll kill everything. Okay, sounds like a good plan. Hey, that's gonna ruin my iPhone! I worked really hard for that. Well, Marty, would you rather get the illness? Um, not really. <coughs> oh my god, Daisy! She's she's got it! She's gonna turn into a zombie. It's not zombieism! Was Myrtle a zombie? Not yet, Marty, not yet. Molly, you're quarantined to your room. Head on up there, please. Oh man! I don't wanna hang out in my room. Wait a minute. I think my iPad's up there, so I'm cool with it. I don't feel so good. Oh, I can't even make it up to the top bunk. I'm gonna have to lay down in Daisy's bed. Oh, I don't feel so good. Oh, I'm not feeling very well. My head hurts and that's well, probably nothing. I'm probably just paranoid I caught whatever Myrtle has. <laughs> Molly, you're deceased! Why are you in my bed? Oh, what? No. Too sick to climb the ladder. Oh my gosh, now I'm definitely... Seems to me, Daisy, you've already got it. Oh my gosh, how did this happen? Well, it started with Myrtle <laughs> sneezing on me and, well, just standing next to you. Oh, nope. <coughs> ah, shoo! Oh, man, Daisy, you got it bad. You better get bed, too. Molly, can you finally climb the ladder up to the, your own bed? Oh my gosh, Daisy, what's wrong? <laughs> ah, shoo! Oh, I don't feel so good. Ah, Mom, you got it too from the infected cell phone. Well, at least maybe Kira hasn't gotten it. You girls stay in here. Get in your pajamas and get into bed. Gotcha, Mom. We understand. Definitely don't give it to the baby. Molly, why on earth did you put a Band-Aid on your nose? Well, I figured that Band-Aids help cure like bumps and bruises and cuts, so I put it on my nose so it would stop running. Oh, ew. That, that's not how they work, like, at all. Molly, you're so gross! Whatever, Daisy! You're grosser than me! I saw you pick a booger once! Girls! Seriously? Go to bed! <laughs> you can't punish us when you're sort of, like, laughing. <laughs> Achoo! I don't have time for this, girls. Go to bed. Fine, Mom. Somebody's a little grumpy. Molly, I did not pick a booger. I saw it, Daisy! <laughs> <laughs> oh, baby Kira, what's wrong? Did you have a bad achoo nap? <coughs> oh no. Don't tell me it's infected you too. How? I I dumped in my prequel had six. Oh no, they had the six? Oh, that's so bad. It's okay, baby Kira. It seems like we're all gonna be sick together. Well, I guess we should go hang out on the couch. Mom! I don't feel so good. Well, join the club, Molly. We're all sitting on the couch together. Sick as dogs. I think I'm going to throw up. Oh, no. Oh, no. Molly, please go to the bathroom if you're going to throw up. Not on the white carpet. Uh-oh. Oh. oh. <sniffs> uh, nah. It sort of, well, came out as a toot. Molly. <laughs> oh, don't make me laugh, Mom. I don't feel good. Mom, I wait a minute, why are you all down here? Molly, you're supposed to be in bed! Why are you bossing me around? Girls, I know you're grumpy because you're sick, but try not to give me a headache. 
I don't feel so good. I'm dying! Daisy, you're not going to die from a cold. Whee! Oh my gosh. I need a vacation for my life. <laughs> nice one. Your mom. You never get a vacation unless we go along with you. I know, Molly. I know. Ah, shoo! Good morning, girls. I'm just about to make breakfast. Oh, boy, Mom, can we have pancakes? Sorry, Molly. I don't have the ingredients for pancakes this week. But, Mom, I really want pancakes. Come on, it's summer vacation. Yeah, that sounds really good, Mom, please. I'm sorry, girls. Uh, there, There's no pancake mix, and I don't have money for that this week, okay? Fine. Dizzy, why are you just staring at the empty TV screen with nothing on it? Well, I'm imagining that we had cable. What do you mean? We, we don't? No, girls, I'm sorry. Your dad and I are trying to save money, so um, we decided to take the cable out. There's still the news station, though. The news station? Who wants to watch that garbage, Mom? Oh, that's so boring. Wait a minute. Is that a leftover piece of pizza? Mine! I claim it! Mmm, so good, Mom. You make the best homemade pizza ever. Molly, that's weird to eat that for breakfast. I think it's delicious. Mm. So, Daisy, would you like some oatmeal for breakfast? No, I'm not really even hungry. <sighs> I wish we could go with everyone else somewhere today. What do you mean? Where is everyone going? Oh, everyone in our school and their families are going to the water park in Brookhaven. Wow, that sounds like so much fun. Uh, how much does it cost? Uh, it's like $50 a person. Per person? Per family? That's right, Mom. So it would be about $200 for us to go. $200? What's the school crazy? We can't afford that. Oh, Mom. Come on. Can't we go, please? You must have a little bit in your, um, in your wallet or something, right? I only have like $3, and I have to use that for gas money to get to, to my job, girls. Like, I don't have $200 to take you to the water park. This is the most terrible summer ever. It's just, I hate being poor. I hate it. <laughs> Ugh, I feel like a horrible mom. I wish I could afford to take you girls to the water park. Molly, come here, please. What? I'm pouting in my room. What do you want? Now I'm going to pout in the bathroom. Molly, come out here, please. What? You made Mom feel really sad. I'm really sorry, girls, that I can't give you more things. Like, you know, expensive tickets to water parks and, and beautiful clothes. But I love you more than anything. And I always make sure you have a roof over your head. Even if it leaks a little. And, and, and I have food in your belly. Even though it's not always exactly what you want. I always make sure that you know that I love you so much. And I hope someday you'll know that that's enough. I didn't want to tell you girls this. I wanted it to be a surprise. But since you're so sad about the water park, I guess I'll tell you now. We're going to Disney? Whoa, Mom, this is amazing! Molly, she didn't say we were going to Disney. Ay, ay, ay. No, your dad and I managed to save up to take you girls to the ice cream shop. Wait, what? That's all we're doing all summer? Ugh, I knew you wouldn't be very impressed. It's all we can afford, girls. We're only getting ice cream one time this summer. Ugh, oh, working three jobs is just killing me. Ugh, oh, I've been working on cutting down all these trees to make lumber all day. And it's exhausting. Well, I guess now's the perfect time to get that ice cream, Dad, since you look really hot. I am. It's 100 degrees outside. Wait, you told the girls about our surprise trip? Well, I had to. They wanted to go to the water park, and we can't afford to send them, even though they're the only ones at school that aren't going to be able to go. Oh, we failed as parents. No, you didn't. We're happy that we get to eat ice cream, right, Daisy? Yeah, I'm going to get my favorite. But only one scoop. It's all we can afford. Okay, well, let's get going, guys. Come on, girls. Get in. Dad, are you sure you don't just want to walk? I mean, your car has a habit of actually not getting us anywhere, ever. It's always breaking down. Yeah, and it smells like a rotten egg fart. <laughs> oh, it doesn't smell that bad. 
Yes, it does, Dad. It literally smells like a giant fart. What's wrong with your car? Uh, the girls do have a point, honey. It does smell pretty bad. Well, hopefully it just gets us there. That's all I care about. Uh, Dad? I smell something really funny. Oh, sorry. That was me. <laughs> Leftover pizza. Does it to me every time. Ah, uh, maybe it wasn't your car that smelled like a rotten egg fart. Maybe it was Molly this whole time. Ew, Molly. What? What? We have money to go through the car wash? No, it's free car wash day. We need to take care of that smell. But Dad, we're... Ah, we're getting soaked! Dad! Well, you're the one that I think is making it smell like a rotten egg fart, so Molly, you need a bath. We could all use a bath. The water's not running at the house real well these days. Ah! <laughs> I got soap in my hair! I think that's kind of the point, Dad. <laughs> not only does the car get washed, we do too! Free baths for everyone! Now that we're all clean and smell good, we can go into the ice cream shop. I can't believe it! The car actually made it this time. <laughs> Let's see, what kind of flavors do I want? Remember, Molly, just one scoop. It's all we can afford. Oh, well, I'm definitely getting my favorite mint chocolate chip. Mm, that is so good. So good. Mm. Whoa, who's that? They're pulling up in a limo, Daisy. Whoa, they look so rich. I bet they're the rip richest people in all of Brookhaven. Ooh, I'm going to get a scoop of everything. Then I'm going to go to the Louis Vuitton store and buy five new purses. Oh, honey. <laughs> Slow down with all this spending of our money. Just kidding. We're billionaires. You can have anything you want. Whatever makes your heart happy. Oh, dear. You're so sweet. Wow. Wonder what it's like to be that rich. Yeah, Molly, me too. I can see it now. This is gonna be the perfect spot for my new mansion. Let's see, which mansion do I want? I am so rich, I can have anyone I every anyone I want, really. Um, it just depends on the the one I think is the cutest. Oh, MG, this one's really cool. This is the one I'm gonna have in Brookhaven, but I'm also gonna have one in Hawaii. And I'm going to have one in Malibu. So this is just my Brookhaven one. Wow. Look at my new house. It's amazing. I'm so rich that I had an architect build this house completely off center. Look at it. <laughs> it's like I'm falling down no matter where I am in the house. This house cost me $4 million. It was worth every, every penny. Sometimes I just lay money down as my pillow. And I, I sleep on it because that's how rich I am. Like I can make money into pillows. Sometimes I even take a bath in money. I'm so rich. I'm so rich. Stacks of cash. Stacks of cash. I got me stacks of cash. I think I'm going to go buy a fancy sports car like right now. What kind of sports car would I want? I could buy a school bus. Yeah, I'm going to buy a school bus and a sports car because that's kind of funny. Ooh, look at this. I really like this. Okay, I'm buying that. It's like not letting me. Okay, fine. I'll try this sports car then. This one's better than that pink one anyway. Oh, uh, yeah. Look at my new car. Oh, I'm so rich. It's just like the best thing in the world. Ah, time to go to the beach. Ah, as soon as I learn how to drive. Whoa, I totally ran into my new house. Oh, well, I'll just buy a new garage if I ruin this one. Ah, why won't the wheel turn? Obviously, I need to hire our driver. I can do that. I'm rich, you know. I'll also hire a chef, and I'll hire, I'll hire everything. I'll hire a housekeeper. And when you're rich, you can do whatever you want. You can sit on the beach all day, just counting your money and feeling the sunshine on your face. <sighs> and guess what? You never have to go to school ever again. Whoa, 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 Molly. What are you talking about? What do you mean, what am I talking about? The rich have the best life ever. They still have to go to school, Molly, whether you're rich or not. Nope. Mm. If I had all the money in the world, no more school for me. Molly, it's against the law to not go to school. You have to go to school. Okay, but the teachers would work for me. That means no more detention. 
Yeah, if you say so, Molly. Molly, would you really want to be rich? Well, yeah, wouldn't be ri being rich be awesome? Yeah, but you'd have different parents and a different sister and everything. Mm, yeah, I guess that's true. So, would you still want to be rich? Well, I sure would miss my mom and my dad. Hey, where's mom? Sorry, I had to go put another quarter in the parking meter. Ugh, it was the last quarter I had to. Well, maybe I can find another one under the couch cushion. <laughs> maybe we could save up and bring the girls back to the ice cream shop one other time this summer. That would be so nice. As much as being rich would be amazing, I sure would miss my mom and dad and sister. Really, Molly? You, you wouldn't, you wouldn't want to be rich? Nah, not if I couldn't be rich with you guys. And you guys, well, are poor. So I'm going to stay being a family with you guys. Oh, Molly, that's amazing. And when I grow up, I'm going to do something awesome, like be a doctor, or a rocket scientist or something. And I'm going to make sure that I buy us all a really nice house. Oh, Molly, you don't have to do that. But you're such a sweetheart for saying it. Yeah, no money can buy an amazing family. And mine sure does love me a whole lot.